Greetings, dear friends. Greetings, lovers of freedom. I greet every one of you wherever you are watching. I say, Mechuko Kikabia Monye Primi Henine. Guide and protect every one of us wherever we are. Dear friends and lovers of freedom, I have come this evening to preach the gospel truth. The gospel truth of Biafra restoration. And I say, Mechuko Kikabia guide and protect every one of us wherever we are. He said, he said, before I proceed this evening, I must salute the leader of indigenous people of Biafra in the person of Maze Namdi Okukanu, the Isafuru Wabobu, the Nukumangu Ikukwana Afwanya, Ufumba Jene Moth Lord. Namuku, Mbedoma, Ututoma, a hihioma, a bobonino, a mamino, a titian. When I can ever the leadership of IPOB, the Directorate of State, DOS, I say, Mitch Cook, Kabi, I'm a guide and protect every one of you. I say, Good evening from here. And I also all the principal officers of IPOB, I greet every one of you and I salute our gallant men, the Eastern Security Network, the Agunet Chamber of our own time, all gallant men of ESN. I say greetings from here. I greet every one of you. I also greet our able legal teams starting from Michael Zekwame to Barrister Ifanye Jofo and the rest of them, I greet every one of you. All of you are doing marvelously well. I say good evening from here. And I also greet IPOB media warriors, most especially those on Twitter, where I am not active like the rest of them. I salute you all. And uh, all of you are doing marvelously well. I greet every IPOB media warrior, those broadcasters, and our comment session warriors. I greet all of you wherever you are. I'm a guide and protect every one of us. Thank you, my people. Let's go this evening message. Very, very important and very interesting. And uh, I want you to pay attention. If you are joining me for the first time, my name is M.A.P. Ezoku Bundu One in Biafra Land. In case you don't like the way I talk or you don't like my broadcast, please, it's not by force. You must be in this page. You can kindly, quietly exit to avoid me forcing you to exit by blocking you. But I advise you, you pay attention. It's not compulsory that you will comment. Just pay attention and learn because a good listener will always speak one or two. Thank you, dear friends. This evening, I will be dealing on the topic, what are they using to hold us down? What are they using to hold us down? These are the topic I want to treat this evening. And when you check the topic, maybe... It does not carry the weight the way you want it. But this very topic, believe you me, if you can pay attention when I will bring everything, the whole packages, the whole sauce in this very topic, you will never regret coming across this video. And if you are in haste, please, you can leave because I want to lecture you. I want to lecture you what you don't know. Because many of you think that is by shouting Biafra, Biafra. Not everyone that shouts Biafra, Biafra wants Biafra. Some are on a mission. First of all, let us ask question. The question I want you to ask, or the, the, this question is, who are the people holding us down? Me, the question is, who are the people? Before you find out what they are using to hold us down, you will first of all find out who are these people holding us down. You must be able to identify the people that is holding you down before 
you will not check on the instrument or the strategies or what they are using to hold you down. Are you down? Yes, you are down. Is somebody holding you? Yes, somebody is holding you. Who are the people holding you down? They are the people that don't want you to rise up. Now, let us bring to the world, to you, let me bring to you, the, you, bring to you the people that are holding you down. The number one people that are holding you down are the British government. And the second people that is holding you down are the Fulani government. And the third people that is holding you down are the Igbo leaders and the Igbo politicians. These are the people holding you down. The British government is number one. And the number two is the Fulani government. And number three is the Igbo politicians and the, the Igbo leaders. Now, we are able to identify the people that is holding us down. Let us ask again, what are the motive or why are they holding us down? This is another thing you need to discover because before you start curing a sickness, you must discover the sickness, the name of the sickness, and you must deep, deep, deep to know everything about the sickness before arriving to the solution to cure the, the sickness. Now, why are they holding us down? The British and the Fulani Caliphate are holding us down for two reasons. One, our natural resources. Two, our human resources. These are the two types of resources we have. And the reason why they are holding us down is because of that two resources, which is number one, natural resources. When I say natural resources, I mean the gas, the, the coal, the timber, the everything that you have in your land that you can use to develop or sustain yourself. These are the things they, they want. Now, your human resources, your intelligence, your brain, what you can produce, what you can offer. For example, the person that built or discovered Gogo is an Igbo man and is a Biafran man. These are the things they need to make sure that they keep you in abject poverty so that they will pick you one after the other and bring you to their country and extract your human resources and use it to build their own country. Why you keep on wallowing in abject poverty? You keep on dying. So because they know if they free you, you will do better than them. They know if they free you, you will break all the yoke and you will be greater than them. And the only way they can do that to make sure that they ride over you is by bringing you down for you to suffer, subjecting you to poverty, subjecting you to slavery, subjecting you to, to all manner of things. Now, let us go the, to the main topic, why I am here. The main topic why I'm here is what are they using to hold us down? I have tell you the people that are holding us down, and I also tell you the motive of holding us down. Now, what are they using to hold us down? This, the tools they are using to hold us down is very, very millennials, and it's very, very deep. Many of you will be shocked because I know the topic. You think I have deviated from the people they are using. No. We are what I will bring here is what will shock you. Pay attention. What are they using? What is their strategies? What is their strategies? Their strategies is what they are using. Now let us come to what they are using. They are using number one thing: divide and rule. Divide and rule. When I say divide and rule, this is one of the dangerous weapons the British is using. And they now lecture the Fulani Caliphate, the same strategies. And Fulani was able to learn it. And they are using it now to hold their friends down. And when they divide you, they will penetrate you. Now, how can they divide you? 
how can they penetrate you remember i am this topic is very deep and if you pay attention you will know that you are the one they are using to hold us down know where you fall and where your stand is because this topic is not what you can just come in and say oh no 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 now let us deal with the divider rule which is one of the most dangerous weapon used by the british and there are now the 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 what is it called the flan caliphate are now using it now come into the movement of ipob struggle ipob was formed by mazinam doku khan to fight to liberate the people of biafra and the ipob is very strong let me use the word past tense and uh, present tense. ipob was very strong yesterday and ipob is very strong today and ipob is going to be strong tomorrow which means ipob is undividable indestructible how are they now trying to use to 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 how are they trying to manipulate you to divide you so that you will they will conquer you now when mazi formed the ipob he lived he formed a leadership called the directorate of state dos and he said to them these are the people that will be seeing the affairs of ipob most of you don't know that biafra restoration esn is not only the the what we can use to restore biafra there is a lot of work Mazi have put in a place that we will use to restore biafra and esn was formed just to protect the land not to be used as a tool to restore biafra esn is to protect the land from the enemies so that the enemies will not capture us why our men are busy why our men are busy fighting diplomatically and when the enemies come physically the esn will fight to wage war against those people now what are the what are they using to hold us down what are they using to hold us down now you will say you don't know they now look into some people the british knows that division can weaken any organization division can weaken any country division can weaken any family division is the only thing that you can use to penetrate causing enemies now the the british government through the nigerian government contracted the gumi of Idu, and they, they tell him go and preach division in ipob and he is causing the division now many of you don't know the consequences of division when they now bring out when you are when you are being used to divide your people inside you you that was contracted know that you were contracted for this job but the people you are misleading don't know that they have helped you to achieve your goal that is the issue we are facing today and that was the reason ojuku failed uh, failed to restore biafra the divide and rule is one of the tools they are using to hold us down and this evening i will tell you the results and the implications of this divide and rule i will tell you the result and the implications of the divide and rule so that you will be seeing it now before mazin amnikano was kidnapped ipob was speaking with one voice every difference under mazin amkan was speaking with one voice the moment mazin amkan was captured ipob was also speaking with one voice and the, the moment the lai lai mohammed say with uh, joy Bope, they say that capture the head and put crisis you know when they contract the person they will not tell the person anyone they contract will not come and tell you oh i have been paid 
for this uh, to cause problem. No, he will never. He or she will never let you know. Nobody who is a betrayer will tell you that I am a betrayer. No, they will pretend that they are fighting for you. They will pretend that they are with you. They will pretend that they are hundred percent with you. Now. You, the question you ask me, how are they using Gumi of Ibo, Simon Eba? They are using him to make, to divide the Biafrans and to make the world think that IPOB has a problem or a leadership torsion. Now, the question I want to ask you, let us bring it to, to uh, uh, start it uh, from the uh, grassroots. Let us start it from grassroots. Now, IPOB was formed. Mazinam Nikan positioned DOS. And the DOS was doing their job. To tell you that somebody was contracted to divide Biafrance and to cause problems in IPOB. All of a sudden, someone tell you that he has sacked DOS from discharging their duty, from seeing the affair of a, of a IPOB movement. What does that tell you? And he is now mounting himself as a leader. That is called division. That is called division. He now tell you that I am now the new leader. The main leader have been sat by me. And I am now the main leader. And you don't see that as anything. And he starts blackmailing. And he starts blackmailing everybody just to gain just the, just to gain uh, audience. Now, before I will go further, I will bring the the the, the update from Mazinam the Khan through Ifan Yejofo. So that when I read it. You will be able to capture what I'm saying because many of you think we are here to joke. No, we are not here to joke. Listen, or let me just uh, go further. Now, after telling you how sack the leadership, he now hijack the financial as uh, fi the finance of IPOB. He now hijack the finance of ipob what does that tell you put yourself in the leaders in the in the in the shoe of our of the leadership of ipob will you allow any criminal to come and hijack your leadership remember mazinam the kind of single-handedly appointed those people and for those people to be dissolved mazinam the kind alone has the power to dissolve any person or to remove any person or to put position any person. Now the British knows that the only way they can turn the Biafran's people against themselves is bringing division. Then bring out Gumi of Idu to focus the division on uh, on IPOB. Then went on and bring P2B to in the other side political way to make sure that anyone Gumi of Idu for straight. And they make the person make the struggle look uh, look childish to the person. The person will left with no option than to start living in a delusion by supporting Peter be thinking that Peter will become president. These are the issues, the things they use. The word divide and use the tools they are using to hold me and you down today. The strategies and one of the most powerful weapon the British and the, the Fulani Caliphate are using today is the divide and rule. That is the very weapon they are using. Today, so many of our gullible brothers are now telling us that somebody is doing it right and somebody who is not doing anything. All of us knows that Eastern Security Network is under the chain of command. IPOB, led by Mazinam de Khan, formed the leadership. And ESN is another structure inside IPOB. And all the commanders of 
ESN are under Mazinam the Khan led IPOB leadership. So these people, the Gumi group now, are the one, the tools, one of the tools they are using to divide our people. Now, when you see some people, they will tell you, oh, I am following Gumi of Igu. You see the reasonable and the and the intelligent one. They are focusing on the leadership and the following mass in the can. But those that are mentally unsuitable, those that are not mentally those that are not mentally balanced. They are following Gumi of Ido. What does that bring to you? Is bringing divide and rule. That is why IPOB, before I proceed, let me re echo what the head of the Directorate of State said yesterday. In case you missed that explosive broadcast from Mazichika Edozium, let me re echo it to your own hearing. IPOB has one but one publicity secretary, media publicity secretary called Emma Powerful. In IPOB, right from Mazinam Nikan, Mazinam Nikan have no provision. Let me, let me repeat Mazinam Nikan has no provision or have ever made any provision, a position called spokesperson. No. Mazinam they can don't have spoke person. IPOB don't have spoke person. What Mazinam they can IPOB has is media publicity secretary. Then IPOB led by Mazinam they can don't know what is Biafra government in exile. You because Mazinam they can himself don't believe in Biafra government in exile. And the people you see today forming Biafra government in Ezai, these are the people who want, who the British and the Fulani Caliphate are using to divide our people, to make sure that there is a divide and rule in, in, in our land, so that it will enable the Fulanis to penetrate Biafrans, so that it will enable the Fulanis to enter our land. Now, they contracted the so-called autopilot and tell them, continue using the name of IPOB and say you autopilot, say that you have two factions. You led this group and the, the other group is for the US. Knowing fully well that Mazin Namdekano cannot be a leader of two groups. Knowing fully well that Mazin Namdekano cannot sanction any group to, uh, to be using IPOB. Know that Mazin Namdekano have already distanced and disassociated himself from all this group. Mazin Namdekano only have and recognize only IPOB. And Mazin Namdekano is the person who introduced command and control. Mazinam they can introduce obey before complain in IPOB. And Mazinam they can cannot destroy that in, in his own absence, knowing the consequences. Now, for me, before I continue further, let me play the uh, bring out what Mazinam they can say today. I will explain it before I will continue with this uh, this uh, movement. Dear friends and lovers of freedom, pay attention to what I am saying here. Now. This is coming from Barista Ifani Ejiofon. Update on our today's visit to our indefeatable client, Oyendo Mazinamde Kanu, at the DSS headquarters, where he is still being illegally and unconstitutional detained in solitary confinement. Now, we visited Onyendu today at the headquarters of the Department of the State Service, DSS Abuja, to provide him with updates on our relevant filings before the Supreme Court, as well as brief with, as well as brief him on other pertinent legal briefings. During our discussion today, Onyendu review partial compliance 
with his rotting medications. Through, though still not administered as medically prescribed, prescribed, sorry. Yet Onyendu is still being denied access to his personal physician. Furthermore, Onyendu directed me, pay attention at this very point. Onyendu directed me to issue this, to issue the foregoing statement. Pay attention. Onyendu directed me to issue foregoing statement, meaning that Onyendu instructed me to make this statement. Because if Onyendu is to be outside, he will make this statement by himself. But since Onyendu is not outside, I will, uh, he instructed me as his lawyer to make this statement on his behalf. If Anye Jofo is not making this statement because he is Onyendu lawyer, no. If Anye Jofo is not making this statement because he is an educated man, no. But if Anye Jofo is not making this statement because he, ha he is in a position to make it known, but if Anye Jofo is making this statement because Mahazin Namdekano instructed him to make this statement, Mahazin Namdekano instructed, ordered him to do this work. And if he refused to obey that Mahazin Namdekano order, definitely Mahazin Namdekano will remove him because Mahazin Namdekano employed him for that service. Now, let us go to the statement that Mahazin, uh, that Mahazin Namdekano the leader of indigenous people of Biafra instructed him to make one that the critical times call for the greatest uh, second spec among his followers because the enemies are relentless, exploiting the vulnerable to exploiting the vulnerable to sustain their status quo, status quo. And further blackmail the IPOB. A blind led by Onyendu Mazinamde Kanu, which is a peaceful self-determination movement. Do you underline that? Did you underline? Do you understand what he said there? Let me explain because that is why I am here. I will explain that because most of times our elbow barrister, this one is for you. They break the English down because most of us are allowed for EGM or English. So now, because on the from autopilot, they will not understand what he said there. To be honest, so pay attention. Let me explain it. Mazinam de Kanu, he said in this critical time, he said to his followers, he said that the enemies is using those that are vulnerable, those that are weak, those that are not mentally tough. The honorable, the, 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 the enemies, who are the enemies? The autopilot, the Nigerian uh, Fulanese government, the British are using these people to blackmail him. They are trying to make Biafra land un, unbearable so that when they commit havoc or when they wreck, when they go into kidnapping, they can use it to charge Onyendu because they have checked. There is nothing they can use to hold Onyendu. Now, they are using you people to blackmail IPOB. Who are blackmailing IPOB? For example, the when Double Lion was kidnapping in, in Uli, in the Iala local government, he was using Eastern Security Network, ESN, knowing fully well that ESN was formed by Onyendu and the man the Kanu is the leader of, the commander of ESN. Now, if Double Lion, working under Simon Epa, can be kidnapping and doing all those things, and the, the Nigeria government can use it to hold Onyendu, because that is a crime. Another one is Gaius, the one-man squad that is cooling his head now in DSS custody. I don't want to post the details or everything I get about him because he is telling me that men that are supposed to supposed to stand gallantly for our, our freedom are now engaging their deaths into criminal. Now let us go to the second point. Pay attention. To the second point. Onyendo has a hard Onyendo has has a hard stance in condemnation of crimes and the dissidents. 
but if I need your phone, able to learn English, you know, all the people. Many of you, when you say dissidents, first of all, what is dissidents? Dissidents is spelled D. Let me look at D I S S I D E N T S. Dissidents. What is dissidents? Dissidents is is the act of working in another policy to bring another person down. Let us contact our Google before I will make a mistake. Let me contact Encyclopedia. Encyclopedia. So that he will bring the, the full meaning. What is the dissidence? Now, a person who opposes official policy, especially that of authoritarian state, a person who opposes policy. Now, in IPOB, who is opposing the policies of IPOB? Who is opposing the, 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 the law, the rules of IPOB? Before you will think, look at it here. Now, in IPOB, who is opposing IPOB policy? Who is opposing the command and control of IPOB? Are they not the, the, the autopilot? Who are saying they are not going to take order from us? Who are the people who is now telling that the leadership is a, is a criminal? Who are the people attacking IPOB leadership? When they tell you opposes policy, person who opposes official policy, person who opposes official policy, Thank you, uh, Michael. Yes, that is, thank you because they think I did not go to Google. That is coming from Encyclopedia. Encyclopedia. Now, who is opposing Mazinam the Kano IPOB policy? Simon Epa, the Gumi of Idu, and every member of Autopilot. What are the IPOB policy? Anything Chike Dosiem says goes. Chike Dosiem and the DOS do everything when they give you order you, you do it if you refuse to do it they they remove you ipob is a non violent uh, non violent or uh, movement ipob is a peaceful movement who are the people trying to turn ipob movement into uh, violent these are the community of the group so you understand what mazinam they can that is why i say uh ebu barry stefan age of obico age is not too much grammar when I saw like our people when we can now water because of Loma do need them the time he got go to encyclopedia. Most especially the autopilot don't even know how to find some words in inside in in, in, in in on encyclopedia. Even many of the autopilot uh, uh, dictionary they cannot find words on it because they are not uh, educated to that extent. The only thing they educate them is come on buy this phone just type mumu mumu. Just that write M O U M O U M O U M O U. When you check their com comment section, what you will be seeing is M O U M O U because that that was what they lectured them. Not many of them don't know how to use phone, not to talk of a uh, smartphone. He make a table on your two pilot uh, high, uh, iPhone or nani. Or, or, or my own India. Now second, let let's go to the second thing. Okay, that's where we are. Onyendo has had stands in condemnation of crime and the, this then which means only to have condemned simon Epa, condemned autopilot and distance himself from it because many of you have what here the grammar since the word only to have distance himself from the people named dos attack which means only to have a distance himself from simon Epa, who is doing the opposite of what the leadership what the authority of ipob says that is what the dissidents mean. Now, let's continue. And he reiterated that he has never condoned nor supported criminality of any form. Hence, the criminal elements who are involved in making lives unbearable to our people should be immediately fished out and dealt with as such. They have no place in IPOB peaceful self-determination movement. Did you hear that? 
Only do say that those that is that is using IPOB, especially those that have now making the lives of their friends, who he is trying to 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 liberate, unbearable. That those that are committing crime in Biafra land should be fished out and be dealt with. Send them to judgment. This is coming from Mazen Namdekano himself. And this is why I am explaining all these things to you so that you will understand the stand where you the position where you are standing today. The third, the that the general public and indeed IPOB should be notified in unmistaking terms that nobody is receiving any instruction from Onyendu for the purpose of encouraging dissident behavior. Onyendu repeated the same word again, dissident behavior. Like Gumi will tell you people, what you don't know is bigger than you. When he said that word, some of you will think that uh, Onyendu is somehow encouraging Gumi somewhere or to continue. Your, uh, Gumi is passing from one corner to be sending message to Onyendu or Onyendu, Onyendu is support of anything. In this message, ordered by Mazinam Dekanu himself, Mazinam Dekanu said that in no way he is, somat is supporting any person opposing his policy or the policy of IPOB, or the policy of the movement, that Onyendu did not send or encourage, not even one minute, to anyone who opposes DOS, who opposes Chike Dosiem, who opposes Tony Zerumike, who opposes uh, 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 Mazichina Sanguru, and the rest of them. Onyendu is against it. And uh, once you are against IPOB policy, Onyendu is against you. What does that mean? It means that every autopilot uh, bingos are working against Mazinam de Kano. Onyendu is telling you right here through Ifanye Jofo so that you will pay attention. So that you will pay attention that Onyendu did not encourage anyone to do that. So the Gumi of Idu, aka Simon Epa, Onyendu have distanced himself from it because from him because uh, he is evil now let us continue well do we stop let me start afresh that the general public and the, the indeed umuchineke should be notified in unmistaking terms that nobody is receiving any instruction from onyendu for the purpose of encouraging dissidents behavior and accordingly disassociate himself from any person or persons who is mis what the fuck the thing up for here let me bring it back let us don't just a minute okay, look at it the thing you have here What uh, let's continue. I will take me back. Number three. Now deal with it. Now let me start from number three once again. That the general public and the indeed umuchineke should be notified on mistaking terms. On mistaking terms that nobody is receiving instruction from Onyendu for the purpose of encouraging dissident behaviors and they accordingly disassociate himself from any person or persons who is mischievously uh, mis feeding the public with such blatant falsehood. Onyendu stressed that he has since made his stance public, uh, public which position is very clear, contained in a viral short clip recorded during one of his appearance in court. Now, like what I just said, Mazinam de Kano is still talking through Efan Ejofo that he did not send Simon Epa to go against IPOB policy, that he did not send Kanon Takane 
to attack Chike Dozier, that he did not send a fake prophet to go against IPOB leadership, that he did not send any autopilot members to start attacking his own policy. So if you somebody is telling you that he received information that you should engage in subordination, that you should engage yourself in misbehavior, somebody is telling you that Mazinam they can't send him, he threw barista through this one or through this one, that he did not send any person to go against the IPOB policy, which the Mazitike doesn't is seeing the affair. Now let us continue. Number four. Onyendo reiterated his call for total calmness in the entire Southeast region and he particularly queried the mental state of those who are relentlessly waging war against his people, the very people he, he had sworn to protect and make life better for. Did you see that? Did you hear? Onyendo is questioning your mental state. I want to burn eye neck. Onyendu is questioning your mental state. I want to burn a pipeline. Onyendu is questioning your mental state. I want to go and kidnap. Onyendu is questioning your mental state. Onyendu naju ijikuanyagi. I am proudly autopilot. Onyendu is asking, are you normal? You are autopilot. Onyendu is asking, are you okay? This is the question Sonyendu is asking you. Do you understand it? Now, number fifth. Onyendu's movement was funded, founded on a peaceful bedrock in a, in a consonance with the universally recognized right of indigenous people of self-determination as clearly and encapsulated under the extent law. Did you hear that? Because Mazin and the Khan knows that he will restore Biafra through law. That is why he's following political, poli po uh, uh, political uh, solution. That is why he's following them through the, their own law through the law court, which is the legal process. That is why he hired a lot of lawyers. Michael Zuckerman is there, Barista Joffo is there, uh, Bruce Fenn is there, with so many of them that we don't even know their names, but they are there. Mas knows what he wants. Did you do it? Uh, I will not respond to comments, but let me respond to this uh, this guy. Chuku the Obioma. You are right that onion uh, that uh, like you said, everyone has the right to do something with his or her name. You you don't say your brand with somebody's name. Hundred percent correct. Now what he means that if you want to fight for freedom in your own policy, create your own organization. For example, you innocent or you don't want uh, any peace movement. He created Biafran. National Guard, DNG. No, but I cannot tell him how to run it because he is the founder and the leader. So if your Gumi knows that he has a roadmap, let him create his own. That is why what uh, Chuko Odiobioma said is 100% correct and I concur with him. So thank you for that. Let's continue. Now, the sixth, the activities of this of dissident. This dissident, they are repeating. Go and ask it so, uh, uh, Simon to make a broadcast. Explain to Umoto Pilot what is dissident and why Onyendu keep on repeating it. This is a dissident, which is somebody who opposes po uh, uh, policy. Let me bring it out. A person who opposes official policy, especially that of an uh, authoritarian state especially that of authoritarian state remember what they are using to hold us down that is the divide and rule and the, the divide now is coming from simon Epa, who is now using what onyendu called dissident to to divide us 
to make sure that he comes he, he caused a confusion among the Biafrans, trying to to play the role the script the the flanny bandit and the british give to him pay attention as we are going down that the activities of dissident marudas who engage in criminal activities have further em, embodying the blood thirsty and the untrained nigerian security agent to unleash unimaginable terror on innocent people of the southeast region this is very important in case you are watching me go to Baris Defanye Jofo page just copy that number six line write it out tell me of you to explain it now what did this number six say is the the people who are operating outside ipob have is what make the nigerian soldiers untrained soldiers untrained terrorists to invade southeast that is what you see happening in Abia state that is what you see happening in uli for more than five days uli is under attack Iyala, uli under Iyala local government was is under attack not was because simon and Epa want to operate outside the ipob he want to burn eye neck who, with his criminal gang and that have bring the army to to the east to start killing people innocent people because you want to oppose the leadership of ipob because you are power monger because you want to take over because you, you have told us that uh, uh, the us are not doing it you want to do it what you don't know is bigger than you simon Epa. Now, Oyendu is making it very clear to them. Pay attention. The way Oyendu, you, you think Oyendu will come out and be happy that Simon has caused the lives of thousands of Biafrans. Each and Oyendu pota, Okubalo Gaka, needs the act of your negligence, out of your ignorance, will be his people, the people he is suffering to protect. The lives and properties only do is suffering today. You are destroying them. So that you want to you want to render DOS useless, so that the people will start disassociating their zest from DOS. Because of that, you now choose to destroy their friends, to kill many their friends. But you never knew that you cannot destroy their friends. Now let us continue. All the very simple. In conclusion. Onyendu remind Umuchineke not to note that the successive landmark victories he recently recorded in the various courts of competent ju jurisdictions against the federal government of Nigeria, FGN, in bracket, may not have gone down well with his, with his uh, traducers, including the federal government. Hence, he insisted that all hands must be on deck to enable Sanas, Sanas' mind to identify the real enemies in our midst and those being used by the establishment to try to implicate and they, or blackmail him. Do you understand it? From every indication, it is very likely that a date will soon be designated designed i mean at the spring court of the zoo for the hearing of onion dues appeal against the other staying the execution of his judgment we will not hesitate to inform umuchineke through approved channel once date is given onion the urge umuchineke to maintain maximum restraint and never to lose sight of the main reason why he is currently undergoing persecution. Onyendu was particularly delighted by the news of your peaceful conduct and he consequently encouraged you all to always keep your eyes on the ball as well all can see the light at the end of the tunnel. Thank you all, Ezibo Umuchineke, and remain blessed. We knew, signed, sir.
ifany e jofo esq ksc ipob's lead council 10th november 2022 that is today now it's very clear Desident mean somebody, a person operating outside the police, opposes a state policy, organization policy, that is IPOB policy, Desident. Simon Epa is operating outside IPOB policy, and he is opposing everything Mazichi Kedosiem have said. He is opposing everything Mazinam Dekano have said. He is opposing everything IPOB leadership want to do. He want to cause catastrophe. He want to cause anarchy in Biafra land so that that will attract the military to massacre our people. How can somebody come out on a live channel like this and tell you that he will start burning eye neck with empty bare hands? He will start burning pipeline. What do you expect? That is a clear invitation to vindicate the killings of, of uh, their friends, to make the killings of, of the indigenous people of Biafra in their own land be vindicated so that he is exonerating the Nigerian army. When you ask Nigerian army, Nigerian army will tell you that those they are killing are the people who want to burn INEC. The Nigerian army is protecting INEC. But all of you cannot understand this. This is the clear uh, script Gumi is playing. He will tell you that he, he wants to burn a pipeline. What is what does pipeline has to do with your freedom? That is to make sure that when you ask Nigerian army, why are you shooting innocent people? They will tell you that they shoot them, they are about to bomb pipeline. Then it is their duty to protect the pipeline. Yes, you see it. Gumi is now exonerating Nigerian army, and most of you don't understand this because you are low in thinking the people that is following gumi are very low in thinking now the divide and rule take a take a look at they are dividing them today why do british always uh, apply this divide and rule they apply it is because that is the only weapon you can use to weaken any person now for example the Gumi now, he knows fully well that he cannot destroy IPOB. What is he doing? He will now deceive some people. For example, he deceived Double Lion. Where is Double Lion today? Ufosisa de Mafia. No matter how strong you are, in the name you bago clickly to go to a That is why you are seeing now. As who causes that you cannot break it. But when you bring one Aziza like this, you can break it. But when you see the bunch of uh, of a broom, you can't break it. Now, the uh, Gumi of you, his duty is to lure you out and make sure that the enemy can kill you because that is the divide. If he bring you out, they will kill you because there will be no more the the the, 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 the other people guarding you, protecting you. You will be alone. You will be thinking that there is somebody somewhere to, to help you, but nobody, because they have lured you out. You are alone. You will never know that you're alone. Don't expect Gumi today. It's like one, uh, one, uh, one, uh, one of us is telling us that uh, the letter wrote is not by uh, making head your high style. No, a criminal can never tell you that he's a criminal unless he's captured like this. Now, Double Lion was lured out. Where is Double Lion today? They killed him. To, because he, 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 that is the weakness. They have divided him, divide and conquer. Now, baby Bush, where is baby Bush today? They lured him out. They killed him. Where is uh, the one called Buhari? Where is him? They lured him out. They killed him. Where is uh, Njenje? They lured him out. They killed him. Where is... Uh, 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 of Pobo, Janja of Pobo, whatever. They lured him. They killed him. They will be bringing you small, small, and they will be killing you. Day before yesterday and yesterday, like what I posted, I said, why are they not posting the result of their Woto Woto? Because they collected Woto Woto. Remember when Gaius, Gaius, where is Gaius today? One man squad. They lured him out. Where is him today? 
That is the strategies they are using because when you are alone, you can easily be captured. Now, let me give you this example. If a double lion, Njenje, uh, Gaius, uh, Buhari, uh, Baby, if these people have not listened to Simon Epa and these people are together as there was before, do you think that anyone can come to penetrate them and kill them? Do you think that uh, the Nigerian police or soldier can overrun like double lion baby and the, the rest of them? No, because they will they will apply that force, the, the non divide, it will come together. But Gumi knows exactly what he's doing. And he lured them one after the other. He did not convince them once. He bring them. And once you question him, he will, he will, he will, he will, he will kill you. Now, inside last week, innocent Oji come out publicly to say that he is not alliance with Gumi of Edo. What happened? Gumi gets angry and directed Nigerian soldier to his camp. He will escape death and one of his men died. That is why I tell you, what are the tools are they using to hold us down? Divide and rule. If there is no Simon Epa, IPOB, we, in the Afro land will be speaking with one voice. Nobody will be listening to P2B. Simon Epa made P2B to have the followers he have today. Because Simon Epa used his platform to make the struggle look like a, it's just a joke. It's a childish. This one will be speaking here. This one will be speaking here. This one will be giving order. This one will be giving counter order. That is divide and rule. And the you that is following him, you that are following them, all of you are the people. Now, let us go to Innocent Oji. And you see the mind game they are playing. Because I am here to reset most of you, your memories. Abelom here, Ibia. Just a minute, I'm coming. I'm here, just a minute, I'm coming. So that uh, I will put uh, things in order. No retreat, no surrender. Just pay attention. We are going somewhere. I am taking you to a place because you will understand why I am Ray Innocent Oji. Type it Ray Innocent Oji. Let us go to Ray Innocent Oji to what he posted and the useless gummy. Commented. Now, this is Ray Innocent Oji in his page. The mind game they are playing. Remember, the topic is what are they using to hold us down? They are using divide and rule to hold us down. And the, the people who have made themselves the willing tools to be used to divide us are Simon Epa, Peter Obi, Innocent Oji, and so many of the Igbo leaders and the political leaders. These are the people they are using to make, to divide our people. And the, our people cannot understand it. Now, after the attack on Innocent Oji, let me play, let me read from Innocent because he think he's smart. I will, he wrote a very long uh, something, but I will read all of them. And after I read it, I will, I will lecture him. We make our lives and, uh, uh, and uh, mission harder. We show a great divide. Indeed, cheer are not happy with us. We laugh and celebrate when our own is attacked. We do this as if we are not on the same mission. We all want Biafra, and we are supposed to be united in this singular purpose. 
This shows that most of us that shout Biafra are only here for something else. I am convinced we shall all unite and they fight this together. We shall all unite under the National Army of Biafra. That is a NAF. We shall fight as an individual. Army and the victory is guaranteed. ESN camp was invaded. He never said his camp, but the camp that was invaded was his own camp. Now, he did not tell the people it's his own camp, but that is not where I am coming. This is my game, emotional game. Pay attention. ESN camp was invaded in Ohofia, and our own lost their lives because the ESN has no has camouflage. Our, <laughs> our very own Biafrans began to celebrate that the enemy soldier have successfully invaded and killed Biafrans, Biafran soldiers. I am shocked because we have no shame anymore. I am not aware this divide has eaten this deep into us. I am only being aware of it now. How then can we successfully defend Biafra without the support of our of, of you? Or permit me to ask, do we really want Biafra? I couldn't sleep since the day before yesterday morning. I go, I go, I go a tip. I go a tip of that. The ESN camp was about to form. We couldn't have moved to Abia on Tuesday night to defend this camp, but we had no healers, healers van or truck to make the move. I had to ask, I had to ask God why he made this mission so hard and painful for me. I had to, I had to ask God why he brought Biafra back without giving us men to help defend it ordinary mobility. To all of you that rejoice and celebrate, may God bless you. May you live long. The will of God upon Biafra shall be done. The will of God upon BNG shall be done. Above all, Biafra shall be sovereign state. Lastly, it is time to unite and I will soon open portals for recruitment. Army is army and owned by nobody. Biafran National Guard is an opportunity for all of us to serve our father. And I am a general. BNG need more generals, major generals, captains, and more and more. All these generals, ETC, will occupy a seat in a Supreme Military Council of Administration. The Supreme Military Council of Administration is, is a decision-making body. Make this open to, to, to tell even ESN commanders and the other commanders of all other groups that military is re regimented and shall recognize leadership of different groups. Military training and indoctrination is the way or identity of a soldier. Now, I believe you have listened to Innocent Oji. Innocent Oji said that the camp that was they invaded was not his camp and he said that he got the information that the according to him say esn he said it was esn but he could not join because he has no van but we saw innocent toji on a convoy stealing biscuit on a petrol station with a convoy with more than five motors where are they we saw the same innocent orgy with a pickup he lost, displaying knockout inside bush where uh, the, the army raided. And he cannot have the, the he lost to rescue his own brother. This is what we call hypocrisy. Now, innocent orgy say he never knew that, he, uh, that uh, we are divided. Now, let me ask innocent orgy because innocent orgy is a matured man who I assume that he knows what is good and what is bad, who I also assume that he knows what his organization and how organization is being run. Now, Innocent Oji 
has a conversation with Simon Epa. The question I want to ask Innocent Audio, on what umbrella did Simon Epa come to you? And on what umbrella, who is Simon Epa representing before you has a meeting with him, before he send you money in August? Since you never know that you think you are wise and you say you know what you are doing, didn't you ask Simon Epa, are you a member of uh, IPOB? Why didn't you ask him? Why did he go into alliance with IP uh, with uh, Simon Epa using the name of IPOB Autopilot, knowing that there is nothing like IPOB Autopilot? What seed are you sowing? If you don't know that Simon Epa is not a spokesperson of IPOB, that IPOB don't have a spokesperson. Didn't Innocent Oji know that uh, Simon Epa is not IPOB representative? Didn't uh, uh, Sim, uh, Innocent Oji know that Simon Epa is not in charge of Eastern Security Network? So what prompted Innocent Oji to go into alliance with his uh, uh, Bumi of Edo, coming out to deny it when there is no more money? Why? Because innocent orgy, you contributed. Innocent orgy is hiding. You contributed in, 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 in causing division among their friends because you know fully well that IPOB is one. And IPOB is under Mazin Amnekan, and any person who wants to do anything with IPOB must follow due process. There is a procedure you can deal with IPOB, and that procedure is the DOS, Directorate of State, who sees the affairs of IPOB. But you, innocent Toji, you ignored the, the, the leadership, and you went, to, you went and formed an alliance with an ordinary criminal. And you want, when you are under attack, you want the IPOB to come for your intervention. No, it, things are not done like that. Things are not done like that. That is, you aided the British government with the Fulani Caliphate to cause division. Because you could have asked Simon, what is the name of your group you are leading? But I saw your statement when you are saying you have right to, to, to work with whoever you want to work with because the money was coming in. Ego na abata. Now you are lamenting, crying foul. And you say you never know that we are divided. You say you never know that we are divided. How will you know? How will you know? When you see that the whole Biafrans, all the Biafrans are under the command of Mazin Amdekan, and you went ahead and formed BNG, what was your purpose of forming BNG? To be shouting United this time. Why didn't you uh, 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 join ESN under Mazin Amdekan command and they drop all this nonsense you are doing so that you will take order where the order is supposed to be taken? Why? Why didn't you say, Mazin Amdekanu, you have what it takes to restore Biafra. Let me take this my effort and support you. But your criminality did not allow you to do that. Now that Gumi of you have happened to you, you are lamenting, you are crying. Who are you crying to? Who are you crying to? You never know we are divided. And you know that Eastern Security Network are in charge of our bush. You carry 80 boys, they parade as the African army. You see, the do you know the meaning of the army? Do you know how many battalions that made up army? Do you know how many commanders and generals that made up army? Do you know what it takes to form a country's army? Do you think that army is formed by eight people? Is it that your eight people you will use to face 82 battalion Enugu division? 
Now, when somebody who is ignorant of the activities that is happening in Jafra will come across this article you wrote, he will think that you are genuine. He will think that you are calling for unity. When you went to Mazinam Dekano's compound, what is the statement? What was Mazinam Dekano say to you? Mazinam Dekano said to you that he had been waiting so long for you to come up. And after Mazinam Dekano recommended you and applauded you, what did you do? You went ahead and go back to create rubbish again. Why didn't you team up with Mazinam Dekano to join force with him? Hmm? Now, you join the Nigerian newspaper to say that your own camp, where you launch Nigerian army or Biafran army, which everyone watch and the picture, you are now referring it as a ESN camp. Why are you, are you I, no, let us, let me understand you. What do you mean? And you say people are rejoicing that uh, other people were attacked. That is the, the, the strategies. Because the, the, the British and the Fulani divide, use you people to divide their friends. As it is now, you say you are commander, you have your own group. Is that not a division? You go and meet Gumi of Idu to divide IPOB. What was your mission? Why you want to divide IPOB? Who are you playing the, playing the script? I am asking you. And Madugi. They, the British who bring the, the divide and rule, they are using all of you to do it. And most of you are playing. Let me tell you, do you know what Nigerian soldiers are doing now? Go, up, go Just pay attention. And the, 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 the Simon is posting this useless thing. When they come to Biafra land and massacre our people, after massacre, if they come with five healers, if they come with five healers, they will kill a lot of people. They will now bring one of the healers that has engine problem. They will take off the, the, their, their people and they load them in another healers and they put it fire. And the video it and send to Simon Epa. Simon Epa with his other useless pages will now be posting it and say they are collecting Woto Woto. If they think they are collecting Woto Woto, Woto where are the dead bodies of the Nigerian army? When he find you back, was attacked in Anambra State. We saw the dead bodies. And the under Simon Epa's Woto Woto result, they will now show the result of a born healers without anybody, dead body inside, without any person being shot. A bluesier, only a, a bluesier blood of innocent Biafra they killed, and they, 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 they draw the person's body on the ground where the healers was born. You will be seeing blood without seeing anybody. That blood you see there, where are the people that died? And when Simon posts those uh, videos of healers born, born by Nigerian army, he will tell they are collecting water, water. Unknowingly to the people that the people that collected water, water are the innocent Biafrans. They collected water, water from Nigerian government, Nigerian terrorists, and Simon will come and type water, water. His own Mubingo will come out and say, hey, water, 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 water. Are you normal? This is what Mazina Mekani is against. Because you are killing the people he is suffering to protect. And when we talk, you say, oh, Mazi, don't go to school. Mazi, you not got the uh, certificate. And the, with you, with your, your all your certificates, Buhari is ruling you. That is why I cannot understand the brain of any person answering autopilot. Because I don't know where the person is. Is the person reason at all? The Nigeria is playing the game, and they are helping them to to market their the, the, what they, to say what they want to want to say to the public. And when you video empty healers, Nigerian army healers, and say you burn it tomorrow, they will now bring another ten healers to massacre people. When you ask them, they will say they are revenging the killing of their people, and the, the burning of healers is evidence. We are you there when they burn healers? Is there any exchange of bullet? Hmm? If you are joining me for the first time, my name is M A P. It's Zoku Bundu One in Biafra Land. One of from Iru. The name is Bozio Martineke. Eli we zee mo zee monde dindo. I am not receiving call. 
but let me hear from this here brother. Ndewo. Ken ken anyo akum. Ndewo wa tin eke. I feel very, I, I was, I feel very sad and uh, I feel compelled to, to call him. Actually, I know you have not uh, receiving call yet, but I decided to call because I, I can't hold it anymore. It, you, know? you know, one thing, there is something about the topic you are, you are, you are you're talking about right now. There is something I want to say here. You know, as of uh, early, uh, early, early October, I made a post. And I warned this innocent judge. I put his picture and some of paper. I warned this guy that if you don't take time, that this guy we we do something that you will ever 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 regret in your life. I made that post, you know. I made that post, and I was very. I feel very sad today when I when I just went to Facebook and start seeing. The the, 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 the the comment and the post and everything it's, it's all over the social media you know I managed to went to this guy this someone uh, uh, this uh, uh, Twitter and uh, Facebook to see what he actually said about this thing you know? he now turn around blaming this problem now to you know who who he always them you know so I, I was kind of wondering. The way and this the way that our people can learn from one thing that already happens to them before. Until when they learn. Until when. Until when. This serious intuition now has been doing this kind of uh, abracadabra he has been doing for over how many years? And for over how long, even since when Marzina Nikala was outside, even since when Marzina Nikala was adopted, this guy has been doing all his abracadabra. Everybody was seeing him. Nobody challenged him. The army didn't go after him. Nobody go after him. Nobody, everybody overlooked him. Barely three months or two months, this guy get in touch with Simon Elba. And barely, barely few weeks, he came out on social media to say, they don't have anything to do with Samarepa. That's the, this guy only gave them one. Barely two weeks or three weeks, this guy made this comment on social media. And the next thing you see was this kind of this kind of attack. Are you telling me now that Nigerian army didn't know that this innocent touch was existing for over two years? Or are you telling me that they didn't know that this innocent touch, even the time when they went out with a go stealing, uh, stealing biscuit and stealing petrol in free station, are you telling me that they didn't know about him? Why they didn't go after him then? Why is it only the time when this guy put himself involved with Sam that I'm very, I, I'm very, very annoyed that they went there to, to because, because I know many of them will die there. I know many of them because all of them are there. I know many of them will die. Tino said maybe we may, maybe have a have a lock to, to escape this attack. But I know many guys will die there. I want this guy. And the next person this thing will happen, and it's already happened to him, and that one managed to escape. Or this one call himself a uh, so maybe league league or whatever he called himself. You know. They're no, they never attack that one. The day they will attack that one, they will pick him up. These people keep putting themselves in kind of, and the way it's paining me is that I have said, let me make it public, let me make this thing very public. This is what they do. Mas, please, in my thoughts for two minutes, we go round the up because uh, there is a lot of things I want to yes. do. So what, yes, yeah, so what I'm saying is that our people should please learn from one mistake. Our people should learn from one thing. Okay. We, 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 nobody, at least if you don't know what to, at least listen to some of us, listen to some people that knows what they are saying. Keep yourself safe first. That is the most important thing. Stay exactly. From this, guy. this is what, the only advice I give this, this people. Okay. It pains me so much that this thing happened to this guy. And I know so many lives will, will, will be lost. For nothing. For nothing. Mm -hmm. 
ndewo dalo now back to the topic before what our brothers just said very important message if you have here listen if you don't have here continue wallowing in 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 in, in a wrong direction ejijin tike na eso nsi o apati ozu ana na idu okay what time ana agwanti manti ano gi ebelisi nti eso lie maka na ndi igbo na eku oku si na eku ye eku mele okenye me eku ba anu ya anu mele o nwata okenye no nu no umu aze na egu onu ni ihu obie o banketi egu che di onu na eburu di okenye tugunye ni mie maka na okenye si gi nno nu na ewe we mo na oburi ba alo okenye alo lan ano no ko kenye si no de ri oke ma no je eze ke lo ma zi oke now the divide and rule is one of the most powerful weapon the british is using they are not just using it only in nigeria against biafra they are using it all over the world that is what they are using today in ukraine that is why russia is finishing ukraine because ukraine don't even understand the game of british and the, the western world now i ask you gaius aka one more squad if gaius was not be, uh, deceived by gumi of Ido, aka simon eba gaius will not be in dss stock uh, custody today if buhari the uh, i have forgotten his real name was not deceived he could have been alive today double lion njenje and the rest of them these are the result of divide and conquer because when they divide you they know that if they come they cannot face you fully how can they penetrate you they will divide you look at the east today they have divided them the eastern politicians they have divided them water water today you will see all jews of but being baptized according to him he is now back also in the name of uh, uh campaigning for for tifnubu all jews of Carlo is now bad uh all the eastern governors are confused they don't even know where they stand and the p2b are being used to give the Igbos a dead hope, hope where there is no hope, fake people, even in mad people, on dollar, on dollar. When you ask them, what is your stand? Why are you doing this? They'll tell you, oh, we are the right people. How can I be under that person? Imagine China Samoru, who is not up to my standard. Imagine China Samoru. How can China Samoru be commanding me? No, I have. I am a man. He gave one idiot that called me. He said that uh, if Mazuna can come out and he, and he follow the US, I will abuse him. I am a man. And I say, are you a man? He say yes. I say no. I don't believe you're a man. He say why am I insulting? I say you're a woman. If you're a man, you could have lead. If you're a man, you will not follow my as I'm coming from. The answer. You could have joined hands. Be a man. Be in the front. At least as much as I'm coming in DSS custody. As a man you are, you could have been mobilizing crowd, block bridgehead, block the whole state, protesting, doing one thing or the other to show that you're a man. now the divide and rule the strategies and the people must be a willing to for them to enter the people who surrender themselves to be a willing to are the autopilot criminals the people who are trying to for the nigerian government to have evidence to present before their useless court are the autopilot the people who are causing the death of innocent difference in Biafra land are the autopilot the people who is inviting the, the the nigerian military are the autopilot how i will answer you now how can somebody come on a live television on social media to tell that i will burn i neck what do you expect the the, the 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 zoo government to do they will deploy the military go there and massacre them 
when they ask you, tell the world that they want to burn high neck. If they are, if they know, if they never burn high neck, the Nigerian DSS by their zest will wear mask and they wear the color of the uniform you know, and they go and burn one high neck when there is no any paper or they will maybe APC can just take note of that and go and they find one of the P2B uh, 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 stronghold and burn the eye neck there to make sure that they get him. Comes here of who? Autopilot. Then after they do it, the same APC will send Nigerian soldiers to reduce the population of people that will vote for the zombie OB. Then they will massacre innocent, ignorant Biafrans who want to go and vote. Do you see how he is bringing the military to come and kill the people Mazinam Nikan is dying to protect? Now, Mazinam Nikan used the word dissident. Just a minute. Why this thing is not loading? Just a minute. Just a minute, just just to tell him. Mm -hmm. Now, the same people, they will be killing our people every day. The Mazinam the Kanu, the same people who Mazinam the Kanu use the word dissident, dissident. Dissident opposes the policy of a state, opposes the, the, the law of organization, opposes the order of Mazinam the Khan to make sure that there is a catastrophe in the land, there is an anarchy, there is unrest, something to attract the, 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 the people, the enemies to the land. Mazinam the Khan said, Let there be calmness so that the enemies will not hold anything. They say, No, there must be no calmness. Rather, we we'll go into kidnapping. You see it. That is why I tell you, are you a willing tool? Are you not aware that you are one of the willing tools they are using? No, <laughs> don't tell me you are not aware. Now, innocent Oji is playing game. Playing game. Telling his telling us that he never knew we are divided. Telling us that he could have gone to the rescue of the, the camp where the attack had been carried, but he don't have a van. One, you don't have a van, and you are calling yourself army. You could have worked on the on the having different vans. Are you not seeing other people in Bazonia? They have vans. Or am I the person that will give you van? Am I a member of a BNG? I am not a member. So don't expect me to to take my hard earned money to give to you. I cannot do so. Do you expect me to leave IPOB led by Mazin American and be sponsoring your, your what I don't know? I don't even know your mission. I don't even know who you are. Of course. If you really if you are really if you are interested or you it hurt you or you you are very very serious about the unity of Biafran struggle. You, you shouldn't have an open uh, BNG, which we know that Biafran army cannot, uh, cannot be, be under Nigerian government. Biafran, uh, sorry, Biafran army cannot be hiding inside bush. Don't you know the meaning of army? Army take over the warfare of her state. As it is now, Biafra have not reached the stage of unveiling any army. Don't you know that army goes with the declaration of a nation? Don't you know the meaning of what army is all about? Hmm? Don't you know the day you, you unveil your army is the day you declare nation? Now, you are declaring, the, you say you don't know that you are, you are in this unity. Who do you contact or who do you consult before declaring the Afrian nation? On which order did you declare that Biafran nation that you celebrated the fake independence on October, uh, whatever, 3rd or whatever? 
Did you consult the people of Biafra? Do they give you the go ahead? Do they give you the support? What seed did you sow? Eh? How can you be deceiving people? You have healers that you used to shoot knockout inside forests and causing, making, making, polluting the air inside forest in the name of you are testing useless uh, knockout you build, say it's a, it's a missus. Now, come to the Igbo politicians. Let us go to the Igbo politicians. Do you people know that the Nigerians have bring the war to us? But their friends don't know. The war is already in Biafra land and the war is going on. And some of you don't know that there is a war. Now, many of you see what is happening in our railway. The old tracks of railway are being removed. Many of you don't know the reason why that tracks, railway tracks is being removed. Is being removed because once they declare war tomorrow, that is the old railway track can be easily fixed so that you can use it to transport some certain things urgently. They are removing it so that you, you cannot be able to, to, to fix it urgently. And in your own koro koro eyes, they are removing it and your mind is not telling you something. You don't know the meaning of railway. You don't need to be building new railway when there is war. What you need to do is to fix the old ones, repair some tracks where they, they need to be repaired, and then allow the train to pass through easily. And they are removing it to make sure that they cripple you economically and they, otherwise. But many of you don't understand this. Many of you think, oh, it's all about uh, this. A pit will be, will be that, will be far, will, they will be good. No! They are in your doorstep. What you need to do now is preparation. Now, some of you will say, Mazi, the army are already in Biafra land. How can we chase them out? It's very simple to chase them out. You cannot use gun and bullet to chase Nigerian army out in Biafra land. To chase Nigerian army out in Biafra land is to follow what Mazin Namdekan said. What did Mazin Namdekan say? Mazin Namdekan said through his lawyer and through IPOB, let there be calmness. No, but you should stop kidnapping, criminal activities, and otherwise. When there is calmness, there is no criminality, there is no kidnapping, there is no robbing, there is no all these activities of Simon Eba. Everywhere will be calm. When Nigeria army come in, you will be able to ask them, what are you people looking here? We don't need you. Everywhere is calm. By there, if they refuse, you come out, you don't need them again. Through protest, army must go. Not through gun. Not through gun and bullet. Gun and bullet will invite more army. I have a caller from Nigeria. I uh, think it should be autopilot. I love, I love them. Greetings from here. Oh, it's like a uh, flashing. Oh, <laughs> do they think I am afraid to pick any call? Omo abu M A P S Y O K U B U N D O one in Biafra land. I don't see people's face. I tell you the truth. Like I said, Mazen am the kind who say let there be calmness. There is a reason for that. This call, if you want to call, you call. If you don't want to call, stop disturbing my phone. Greetings from here. Yeah, greetings. I'm calling from uh, Nigeria. Calling mm. from River State. What up, please? I want to find out uh, most of the time uh, uh, why is there why you people have so much in fighting at this point in time it's supposed to be in uh, unity unifying different groups not uh, today you they are packing one another one another either Simon Eba uh, the other guy is he or G talk about OG in fighting while 
Nigerian government is busy uh, 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 desecrating the land, killing innocent people in different villages, uh, uh, region. Thank you, my 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 brother. Can I ask you a question? Can I ask you a question? Or did you did you ask question or should I ask you because I have not understand you? Sorry. Okay, I perhaps go ahead. I just I was just uh, I, I was watching what you were talking about. Okay, now let me let me first of all answer you. Your if I'm not mistaken, you ask question why are we fighting? Is that your question? Yes. Uh, thank you. Just, I listened to your talk briefly. I noticed that you were talking about somebody, uh, Simon. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah uh, thank, thank, Simon. thank you, my brother. That is a very good question and uh, it's very, very important. And uh, I like the way you come down to ask questions because in our language, our people say, he who asks questions does not miss road. Okay, yes, I know I've watched uh, a video on uh, OG uh, on different occasions. Yes. Uh, uh, let me answer you. Give me time to answer you. I did not, uh, first of all, I, in this program, I did not attack OG. I correct him for his mistake. And the, coming to Simon Epa, why I attack Simon Epa is because one, IPOB is an organization formed and lead by Mazin Namdekanu with the members of the Directorate of State, which in other words, I will say with the executive members. And I know you are matured to know what is organization and executive members. I believe you know, right? Okay. Now, somebody who is not part of this organization, somebody who is not part of the executive member, Somebody who is not a, 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 who does not know anything how this organization formed or function, come outside and tell you that the executive member of this organization, they are the pe people that showed the president or the leader of the organization without evidence, without any proof of what he just said. And the person who is not a member of this organization and is not even an ordinary member, not to talk more of being executive member, come out and tell you that he has sacked all the members of all the executive member of this organization that he is now in charge. Now, what will you do as a member of that organization? Somebody who is not your member is not a executive member, is not anywhere. He has nothing to do with that organization. Coming out to tell their friends or to tell congregation that he has sat a member, a, a group that is not a member of. Won't you tell the address the person or position the person where he belongs? Uh, well, if, if, if there's no proof, if he doesn't have proof, Proof of what he's saying. I believe before saying that there must be a proof. So why didn't he bring the proof? So, if there is no proof, I don't know if he well, if that's what he says or not. But if he says that without proof, I mean people his his uh, saying will not go far. People will not believe. Now, and secondly, for me to attack the he saying, for him to have must, must, I mean for him to have said that, I believe or assuming there should be a proof. Okay, let me ask you this question. No, my brother, listen, 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 because listen. Can you listen? Can you listen? The person we are, the organization we are talking now is led by Mazinam Dekan. I hope you are aware of it. Now, Mazinam Dekan have said, and I quote that he never supported any person nor encouraged such movement. And Mazid has said to him through his lawyer that he should stop meddling into the affairs of IPOB. Mazid is working with his legal team and the leadership. The person, can you now let us use you for example? You form organization and you are fighting for the liberation of a river state. You are from River, right? Yes. And you have executive. And uh, you are working with your executive, and Nigerian government kidnap you. 
and I am not a member of that organization you formed, and I, I am not a, a member of your executive. And uh, when you, as you was kidnapped, I come out and say that those of your executive sold you. They are the one who plan your, your, your kidnap. And you come out through your lawyer to say that is a lie, and you debunk it. And I continue saying that I have sat your executive because I know you are in the hands of the enemy. You cannot come out to address your people apart from through your lawyer. And you say to your lawyer, tell your people that anything this your executive says is what your people will follow. And I continue fighting that your executive. What do you expect that your people to do? Can you answer me? To do to me? To unite to me or to fight me? What will you do? Be sincere to yourself. Yes, it will be um, from from what you said that the spokesman. They are doing a lot of uh, uh, stories in the head. Like I think today was it today Vanguard or yesterday? <laughs> they talked about uh, Mazi. fighting. Mazi. No, 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 I said use. I use you leave Vanguard. I want you to answer the question. Then we can go to Vanguard. That there is an infighting within the legal team on who to represent or who is the Mavis, who is the uh, leader, I don't know, between the legal team, whether it's between Mike or um, um, uh, Zifani or so, yes. That there is, an, there is another person outside, uh, the foreign. My brother. The American. My brother. I am not interested in that, your story. Vanguard is not an IPOB leadership. Like I ask you. I just give you an example just now. Just answer me. Be sincere to yourself because I don't like when I will ask questions. Person will leave my question and be telling me story. What the, the gods are this and this. Answer my question. I give you simple analysis and I ask you simple question. What will you as what will you tell your people to do to me? That is my question. After all you have done, all, all I have done. Statement is truly coming from the legacy through it. His mouthpiece. That is the issue now. If they are the mouthpiece, uh, the people will follow the flow now. But in these circumstances, my brother, my brother, I ask you, you yourself, I am asking you, who is the mouthpiece of Mazenam the Kanu? That is what I'm saying now. That we've had. I told you about the uh, information from Vanguard. My brother. Okay. Which lawyers represent Mazinam the in Court of Appeal? Uh, this one we have uh, is it Bruce? There is one U.S. Uh, based in Bruce. Uh, so Bruce Payne yeah. represents Mazinam the in Court of Appeal in Nigeria. Yeah, he, he, he came around one. To represent Mazinam the in, in Court of Appeal in Nigeria, uh, Mr. Ma, what is your name? Mike is there. If I need, uh, brother, uh, brother, uh, brother, what is your name? There are three of them. My brother, what is your name? It's John. I'm John. Stanley John Well. John. John. Yes. yes. Are you listening to me? Yes, I'm listening to you. You sure say they're listening to me at all? I've been listening to you now. Now, 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 answer my question. Answer my question. When I was, let us discuss. I don't want to get angry because I, I will control my temper. Please. No, we are not discussing. You are taking this uh, discussion as a child uh, discussion. I don't like it. Please, let us ma be mature. Can you name the, 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 wait, I am coming. I am coming. I am coming, my brother. I am coming, my brother. Please, who is Mazinam the Kanu legacy lawyers? My brother, John, 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 John. John. Yes, I can hear you. Can you listen to me? Yes, yes. Can you answer my question? Simple question. I said, let me repeat my question again. And if you refuse to answer, 
then I will know that you purposely uh, they misbehave. The question I ask you now is that you formed organization named River Freedom Fighters. You are from River. And you formed, are you formed executive that you are working with? All of a sudden, I am not your member of that your organization. And you was kidnapped by Nigerian government. And I came to the public because I have a big platform. And they tell the public that your executive that you selected, that you have been working with, they are the people who sold you. And the you, John, through your lawyers who have been representing you, debunk that news, say that the, none of your executives sold you. Okay. You debunk it. Wait, I am coming. Wait, I am coming. Wait, I am coming. Wait, I am coming. I am coming. Wait, so that you will understand the question. Now, this me, I come out using my platform to say that I have searched all your executives without your permission, without hearing from you, that I don't suck all your permission, and I will no longer take order from you, that I am now in charge of your organization. And anything I say I goes, I am now the spokesperson. Then the security outfit you created, I say that my name is the name of that security outfit, that I am now in charge. Now, the question I ask you, you, John, who is the leader of the group, and you have debunked such thing from through your lawyer because you cannot speak, what will you expect your group to do? To unite with me or to fight me off? Uh, well, you said debunk. That's why I want to interject first. Debunking what we have not seen any debunking. You have not seen any debunk. I have not heard any debunking from the legacy in that regard. Okay, okay. Let me let me take you back. Do you follow if I need your phone? I I times based after court proceeding. Okay, I, I, a I, simple I, question. When if I need your phone was he interviewed I, by Judge Money, what did he say? I, if I knew Jofo was interviewed by a platform called Judge Money Blog, what did he say? Judge Money Blog, I I don't know about that. I know I'm listening to his interview different, on different platforms. Okay, um, let that one is number one. When he find a Jofo after the court of appeal judgment, and he was granted interview, what did he say? He, he talked about the judgment. Mm, what did he say about those that is fighting IPOB leadership? I don't know about that one. I know he was talking about the judgment and uh, he was trying to interpret the judgment and the next move. Uh, so, uh, okay, okay, which I means you are not current at all. You don't follow if I need your for you just follow gossip. Now, uh, my brother, my brother. Uh, John, 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 no, wait, John, John, answer me first. John, 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 don't allow me to cut you off. I don't like people behaving like your children. When you are talking, listen to who you are talking to. You have, you have here, yeah, listen, listen, answer my question. The question I ask you, if you are, if you as the leader, what will you do? Leave about Mazin, uh, leave the lawyer. I now use you as an example. With what I just said, answer my question. What will you do? I 
mean as the leader in the faith in the house of the river of the leader of the river association freedom that you formed and somebody accused your executive that they sold you and you through your lawyer because you have legal team through your lawyer you say that your executive did not say you that people should disregard it through your lawyer lawyers now the person now come out and say that he have sat all your executive without hearing from you without you authorizing it that he have sat all your executive that he is now in charge and they start using your name to raise funds you now what will you do will you expect your 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 executive and your followers to unite with such person that is not your member or will you expect them to fight the person off uh well there are two things that if uh, the person is in communication that, that, that would be a uh, uh, do you understand english at all would you understand english at all wait do you understand english at all uh john 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 John, John, do you understand English at all? John, John, do you understand broken or English? Which language do you understand? Because it seems that you are you don't understand anything at all. You are talking like a foolish person. Sorry to use the word. I ask you simple question. Put yourself in the shoe. You are telling me if if did I use the word if? simple question i did not say i said you have said to your to your followers you you have said which means you and you are a dead man then i used the word you have said the message i didn't say if i put you for example you that is talking now i put you in the position i said that you formed a group and that group you formed you selected the executive and this executive was working with you and you was kidnapped me that is not your member that is not your executive i start fighting your executive to the extent telling them that they, i tell your pe people that the, your executive showed you and you come out and and you through your lawyer you say that is a force that I, you people should not listen to me and i come out and assert all your executive members say that i am in charge i ask you simple question what do you expect from your group and you are telling me if which means you are even a dead man if you cannot answer tell me that you cannot answer let me move on i don't have time for for, for small children in this program i don't have time for imbecile the guy is an idiot even if you take that bingo you know people will say i insult people i don't carry to insult people i will try my best i was trying my best to calm down but the guy has shown that he is so stupid he is so stupid and and useless how can you form a group and they say you are following if I Jofo. You don't even know Bruce. He said Bruce Fane is the one representing Mazin and the Kano in the court of appeal. Bruce Fane. To see how damage Simon have caused to these people. When I uh, call on WhatsApp, hold on, please, Fabian, hold on. When I tell you that 90% of the people following Simon Epa are bingos, you, you will say, oh, Maz, why are you abusing them? Why are you cursing them? now you see how stupid that man is he called john although we know the meaning of john sir john john what do he know ordinary john my you mean now now john who don't know he give order he don't even know his so his father property now i can come and say his father property is not his own again and he will be uniting with me on your some now check you know why i keep on bringing the autopilot because for you to see their brain I exercise patient for more than 10 minutes or what is more than 20 minutes so that he will understand and this thing first how did the, uh, Bruce Fane become a uh, IPOB lawyer you how can you unite with a criminal 
These are the reason why God, Jesus wept. I have tried everything within me to hold myself, but the guy continues showcasing his stupidity and his idiocy. Call on WhatsApp, go ahead. I'll give on my, my, my Bluetooth because I never plan to receive call. I never, I never call. Why are you wasting time with this idiot? No, that is my job. I try to emulate my leader, Mazinam Dekan. He will always try to, to, to have time with them. When they, when he try and they uh, see that uh, their brain is over damage, he now let the person go. That is why I try. It's my duty. But I've seen that uh, the, the, the are coming in his brain. Simon have already damaged that bingo brain. And that is why I don't like using insult. I say I will not insult people, but these people will force you to, to insult them. So who, who, who told him there is a crisis between the, the legal, legal teams? Is that, why is he digging deep in that thing? Why is he asking that question? Now, Vanguard News tell him. But he never tried to find out because Vanguard News now. This infiltrate, this time on ever. This time on ever. The carnage, the carnage this man is talking in Japan now. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's overwhelming. I've suggested, I've suggested, my suggestion to, 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 to leadership of this IPO. Is for them to facilitate the arrest of this man from that Finland, so that it, so that he will stop this. Uh, is it not high time to go after this uh, after this man? We will not go after any person. IGOB leadership will not go after any person. You know why? Anyone who choose to make himself vulnerable. To this very to, to, to be used by the autopilot we surely pay when the time comes. So what IPOB is after now is the restoration of Biafra. It's more important. After the restoration of Biafra, every rules everybody play, there will be a court and there will be law for them. You will face your crime. But uh, we, uh, in Biafra land, they know how they play. If they play, they show. So we will not take any person to court. Mas make your make your uh, uh, your 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 contribution. Make it snappy. Well, my contribution is uh, um, is uh, is uh, what I'm saying is uh, this uh, this uh, Simon has caused more harm than more harm in this uh, struggle. Simon ever has caused more harm. But the annoying thing is this is his followers following him. How can somebody, how can someone say he is going to restore Biafra in 116 days? Yeah. And he cannot stop, he cannot stop the army military killing, killing Biafra from Ohio to Izumbe, from Izumbe to Osu Izumbe. And he can, he can make, he can make, in a week, in a week, he can make three, 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 three point races, three times point races. Uh, who, who are these people? Who are following? Who are, is, uh, is this people following this man? Are they yeah, are they or, 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 so, or Where are they? Where do they come from? Most of them are the cross. All these uh, the, these people that answer the name South South, like the one that's called John. You don't know the name of IPOB legal team. You don't even know. Uh, you you, uh, you don't even listen to Ifan Yejofo. You are listening to Vanguard as IPOB spokesperson. How can somebody open mouth and say that IPOB spokesperson is a Vanguard, Vanguard newspaper? Is Vanguard no longer a Nigerian uh, newspaper? So Vanguard now is a freedom fighter and is a person. So when you see them, you will know them. We will know them.
Turn about the whole thing to Christ. Don't need to be the answer. Someone has brainwashed or probably they are not they are not evil. I'm I'm saying they are not evil. But what I'm saying is someone is receiving the carnage is not in in their balance. He go deceive only the people he want to deceive now. Now who are allowing himself to be deceived will be That's deceived. Mas, please round up. Someone ever is the only the only thing well everyone else since we are not going to go after after him now. The only the only thing we are going after him now. Yes, yeah, who is this caller? Hello. 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 Who, uh, who, uh, who you be? I be. Uh, tell, uh, tell us your name and where you are calling from. Oh, what? Mas round up, round up, please. Someone brought us from the Olivia ESN. And they are sitting there. They are sitting there. They are sitting there. They are sitting there. Actually, but they are the original. Mas round up, round up. He allowed them through money. He bring them out through for money. So what I'm saying is there's nothing I'm so I'm so angry about the whole thing. Thank you. Thank you, my brother. Thank, thank you for your wonderful contribution. Thank you. So please go, go, go on. 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 Go I know what I did, and I know why I give the person uh, 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 the chance. Just uh, one down the that, just a minute. I will call you by myself, please. Let me. I bet who has my number should put my number on the comment section, please. Anyone that has my number. Anyone that has my number should put me help me put my number on the comment section, please. Hello, ma. Yeah, I just send them your contribute. I have to talk you now. Uh, today you have two minutes because I have a lot of you only have two no minutes. No problem. I just want to talk. Uh, the no innocent OG you are talking about. That is the only thing I want to uh, talk. Thank you, I'm Facebook. I'm not talking users. about people that their brain has been destroyed. It's not even only um, most of them. It's not that their brain is destroyed. Just like uh, they know what they are doing. There is these people because with division, the they believe their son will not come. Exactly. But they don't know that they will make it quicker. So, like the person you are talking with now, he couldn't answer that question because you can't say that you build a house or you have a property or you establish a company and they fool from nowhere. Come and suck all your workers and say, now I am in charge of your company. Nobody will accept it. They, they know what they are doing. So you know what I want to say? They, what I'm trying to say is we must be told you. If you look at the statement you, yeah, the, uh, the, the write-up he put up, yeah? Hmm. You can see that indirectly is asking for contribution. He wants to use this uh, opportunity now to make money. Hello? I'm listening. Go ahead. The word is listening. Yeah, he wants to use the opportunity to make money because he's saying that he doesn't have uh, he looks or whatever. 
to go and fight and help his brothers. According to him, they are, they are ESN. So he doesn't have this thing. Because every opportunity, every opportunity, like you rightly asked him, when he went to Gumi for that uh, alliance or whatever they call it, what was the discussion of how did Gumi introduce himself as? And it, Call Oli on WhatsApp, please. He knows that that POV did not start today. He knows that a organization like this, that, that there must be a standard structure. There must be an organogram. There's no a very big, big, big organization like this. There must be a strong foundation. So when he had this discussion with this guy in Finland, what was the introduction? How was it? What did this guy introduce? He said on Facebook. This caller, I will pick your call. You will just uh as you people have been saying, he has do, he has been doing his own thing. Nobody has come to him. Nobody has done anything. Anybody that associates himself with Simon, that will meet that person. Simon of Ocho. And I hear, he also called me. my contribution. I don't have much to say. So, but no more innocent. All church of him when we are over. All God will be me to be done, Maria. This caller from Nigeria, if you, I just caught your call and I don't want to hear your call again, please. My sister, please round up. Yeah, all these people, all these people that our, our, the, the, that died, our strong men, is because of money. So innocent Oji, if he cares, he knows what happened to him, and then he knew he he starts knowing what happened to him. He's better for them. That's Sim the only thing I can. Do. Simple as that. Thank you for giving me the opportunity. Yes. Thank you. You. This guy keep on calling. He keep on calling. But you know your brain is empty. You are calling. When your brain is empty, don't call on my program. It gets me irritating. If you know you can be answering my question, you can call. But if you know you cannot answer question, please don't call on my program because I, I even I say I will not be insulting people. But don't force me to insult you, please. Welcome to the program. Tell us your name and where you are calling from. Hello, my. Hello. <laughs> Hello. I say I don't admire you. God forgive me. <laughs> My sister Gawaniru. Okay. Give give you my heart choice I give her his food. Then go by ya because he had a little shoka. Then where anything that they can't create anything. I have a hand of a run no no. Have you a ton one ya? Simon Epe will be a dark oak. Oh, all a pastor.
ihuru onye abu no no chori izo aka ndo ha chori ano ha bu haka ha na aga agwa choto agwa mile exactly tetuku dere te wo na bia fra aga bia akwa ndi ndu no nwe ha a confess wa lu gbu a si na na ma ji na ndu kwukware ku na ma ji na ndu kwukware ku ndi ndu no nwe ha na confess bi a ugbu aka ha hwa ni ha ma ji na ndu ka nu ke gbogbo so e we slo gbe with him and a a pure kunda ha auto pilot asana hang to nearly e were le mini something ta ha brain so brain ha not the baby ha no exactly dico o ta ko ha no no tu ta na agbo no me e in fact ko nu were ogolo gondo ko nu ni ile no ni shi na alu ogu a ni ti ti le ke na dugo no dugo ezi no lo ni ni se ni se he said, Chebeco is in on again. There won't watch in a can there won't. Dalurin, I really appreciate your kindly advice. Just that I was trying my possible best to know if he can have small brain, even if I will go to Kay with a no Bogon Kay rabbit. But uh, it is unfortunate. It's unfortunate. Please, scholars, you make it uh, possible. Two minutes, please. Two minutes, you round up, please. Greetings from here, your name and where you are calling from. Greetings from here, your name and where you are calling from. Hello. One uh, Ndevo. Evangelist B. Evangelist B. Okay. From Ireland. Go ahead. Do you have can you hear me now? Loud and clear. Do you have question for me or you have contribution? You have two minutes. My brother, in a, a world too much, he couldn't do because now from the beginning, he could say, Man, no, no, to Simon. But I want painful thing on in a male world that now our people are ladies in all for me. I wrote to Madigate, Jim, well, an organization lay it down structure. Seen a go to a call, see even somebody after that, I fight the lawyer. One day I saw in the Facebook when they attacking a Jofo, attacking Bruce Finn. Now you always go there for a walk on a Tuesday. I'm not doing him there. Man, I kill out today. How to try the next to this guy because many IPOB members are so quite this man. I can work on the coordinator. The non unity DJ can I go soon we hear Sinaka this guy because he directly silently and I am okay. And this is the reason why British city were problem with Indigo people who are not organized. And they buy like wrong, all her like organization. And we have and we have respect for leadership. That's why the Awagana Igbo Union meeting me in Aga Bidia will talk. Aga Aga Kosafia will talk. When I'm as a man, the kind of warrior with three discipline na Igbo, discipline among the Biafrans, created this unit. Now, this unit where big people ga Woro, Ibia, he follow the rules of leadership. He don't want a name where we structure no wa, and where we kick off, man. Anything exactly. that is not well structured can never prosper. When our people, Zuzure, Zuzuru, Nesunguka, who can create a problem, Nanibo, up to provoke the military, up to provoke the governor, and I'm going to have seen them one by one. They are not seeing all these things. I don't know the type of thing on a brand in the buy. Mana, I just want to encourage you. Kachineke Bagume. Onye choro imu ezioku, ya kuru nezioku, onye na choro ezioku, aga neri eri chakwa ya, at the end of all that number of ways, onye ibe ibe. Exactly. Mwa, I stand with the DOS, no matter what, that structure ma azen na nekano, that's the reason why oji nyaye instruction of oath taking, so that I got a full strength, disciplined. I had to get disciplined, I had to get disciplined. That's why. The full and it is giant with no bochita. I want to be what I did. I want to be intelligent. I look at me, we can deal with these people. Man, at this organization, 
I did know to. I go before all that, so I have the Ndugun and the Ndofeji, I na more quiet. Only when I got to know you at the same time, only in a respect, you there. Mana, to cook or jiggy jiggy. Daloka, there were watching her, and there were Dalor in there. Dalo. The arrival of Queen of Woto Woto. Greetings from here. That is a great, uh, our great brother, Evangelist B. And uh, let me, I could see, I could see his calling, and I have to bring him in. Now, I'm going to get time, can wrap up here because there is a lot, of, a lot of things to say, but I will continue this topic tomorrow. And then we're watching, okay. Yeah, my Good evening. Good evening, my brother. I don't have much to say. Uh, my name is uh, Damike Navakusi. Mm, so, if I say can go, I don't have much to say. This caller made a very good point because these are our people that is complaining. Most of them are those people that call themselves South South. They are exactly. really complaining. We are fighting ourselves. We are doing this, but when this Gumi started this, any person that was expelled from IPOB, the Gumi, we called him back and started fighting the leadership. So if I need for one of them now, more than happy to fight here the leadership. And I'm not sure you are doing a great job. But I'm more than IPOB media will be the fight about Gumi. We are fighting ourselves. We are fighting each other. Malama lo no hawa bi dolu bu ndio auto pilot wa bi dolu sina ndio es le lo mazi na me kan oyen ka le mazi na me kan mba ka ai na yo pa o ka ai poko so ni hai ni member okay kita na no da bi doga ha kita ka ha na ti si ai na we mo so we suppose so na di kuni di ngumi na e be ge bele ka yo na ti ana and your man wa drop us ever ma am i am my united with india because i na he muro wa na ideology okay can you imagine Woman was in quite the movie video. I must broadcast on radio Biafra without a uh, uh, condition. So often I have to learn now on that canon fan, and you know, we did broadcast on radio Biafra by now. Oh, yeah, no, on radio Biafra, not no good there, but I make cock. Oh, we did the major hook, but then I'm the canon ever. Oh, if I behind this, I avoid it because who know now, maybe the better radio Biafra. Okay, me pay the two way twelve months and none they can. I'm a new estimate of the Haname, which is a man down a radio piafra announced wire. So that the Timago, a good canaba. I am a little hammer, who is over a kaya announced on a radio piafra, who be high game. I'm a man de media, but on I announced on a radio piafra. Bob and I could not email, I could never email this thing. Oh, I tell you, I'm not. Mazia, you see, or quick a radio be after yesterday. Yeah, again, yesterday. Thank you. Oh, no, 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 I am my fed teacher and Hanabo. I know now my area on Abba. Allow the gullible bingos to be claiming credit. Anything the leadership name, he need the announce. The only thing I got now, so like Adam Shani Bagay Goginaba. Makana, we will soon fund our, make our fund again. Eka Yaka Tequa, your own. So that is the only thing you talk. You go wrap the activities of the US and all of me here in this course here. Because the US have achieved a lot, which more they are aware. They did not tell me, but I am aware that they have discussed, they have they have achieved a lot. Which more na fe mo ema ya. So I believe everything. Can you adapt to be na ma? Oh, my son, talk. How what happened the other pilot? Because actually, he had need na te. He may be afar barite fine is your for hard need limit be afar damn. Because barite is fine is your for what? But the look me no no. Oh yeah, maybe so. He had a no. He may not go. This is Uji Uji Bruce Fenna when I attack him by the FIA job. Since Bruce Fenna is in the letter, 10 years is now five years. 
Since you're there, but they have a grocery. Because none of the grocery are Google and Nikita because we just have a little bit of sorrow before the grocery is here. All the way I'm going to think. All the way I'm going to have a good time. 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 I'm going to have a good Okay, honey, I have a lot of people that lie to me. They can't make it. It's not same charging when we bond you to a Western IPOD cable, and you mean when they see a screenshot. Oh, for you, I see any other command of ESN, and no of ESN. Where does your name here as an ESN cable? A cable. So also the, also the, you know, same charging. When I blackmail the ESN, and also quite all the method resignation in the money home map. I hope now you make one more ego when I be an abba fundraise in fundraise. So even now, when the open and they follow me, and then the open and malify in a mevona, I POB when leadership and the gumi have a POB member, and come on, one more time, I will have my POB member, which is amazing. My leader, you say my receipt if you go see here, you say the picture, go see my receipt. Man, the round of up, they go five minutes, round of up. Jisi keni fine mena aivundi aipiobi watalege na lo fine na kono dili dili da chip nizi. So na viyamu aliko jisi kero. Nde wamwa chini ke dalorine. I have a lot of callers here. Let me call this one back. I don't know who he is. If he can call back, call back. And anyan kashi from Nigeria we na bo na bo na bo pasa. Iyo ja bo kana malo brain ingwelo. Where now, boy? Ordinary brain, no kitty. In well, then you will look for me now, boy. Why are you fighting each other? Why are you? They will tell you why are you fighting each other? How can somebody be scamming people and you don't want to fight? Somebody say he's, he has sacked your executive and you say no, you don't. And the, the guy, we are. I just explained the meaning of a uh, um, dissident to the guys here. And the, I am saying what Mazin Amnikanu say. And the the Obele Umwa Benketa. Yet, on a claim no that on on a follow if any job for man on other what if any job for Bruce Fen is now IPOB lawyer that represent Mazin Amnikanu in a key court. All these people who are south south, I'm not sure how or where come. That is why you see the other pig, Greek pig, uh, called Asari Tukumbo. All of them, let me call this man back. Uh, is he a man? How will I know he's a man or woman? I pray. autopilot, Jesus is in a day of under Rusin, he can have a funda on Aya. The reason GMA broadcast are blocked for the people who know with the DOS or for the people who know with autopilot can never reset have their brain because all how I can't you make here. Hello, Mab. Tell us your name. Hey, good afternoon. I'm Bright. I'm calling from Kevin. Okay, Bright, go ahead. Do you have question or contribution? You have only about two minutes. Anyway, what I wanted to uh, uh, ask, I, I actually posted it because I called you, you weren't taking it. So I hope you have seen the post. I just wanted to ask if uh, our leader is with us, Martin Amdekano is with us here, and then Martin Maneba have what it takes to bring Biafra. I want to ask, will our leader support him? Is a question. Thank you. If uh, Mazin Namdekan is out and Simon Epa, aka Gumi of Ido, has a strategy, not what he take to restore that, because if he has what he take, he will go and restore it without Mazin Namdekan. If he has a strategy, he will present it to Mazin Namdekan and the, the leadership of IPOB. And the, the leadership of IPOB with Mazin Namdekan. We go into the strategies because for now In all one side in Etrianya, Oga Boogie, Oga, 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 Yigi, W, Atanso, Ye M, 
So when he if he has a strategy, he will present it to Mars and the canon and the leadership. When they go through it, they will not say, okay, this is your strategy is good. Let us apply it. Then the leadership will apply it. But that will only be when he is working genuinely to fight for Biafra restoration. But if he say he has something to restore Biafra and he don't want to be ma uh, under Mazin Amkani, he don't want to be ITU, he don't want to uh, be submissive and the discipline. Mazin will tell him, Simon, since you have what it takes to fight for Biafra and you want to do it, do it with your name. Don't involve IPOB leadership. Don't use the name of IPOB. Mazi will not allow Simon to use IPOB or add any name of IPOB to whatever he wants to do. Let him go and establish his own and do it. Mazi will, will say, go ahead. For example, when Barista Onwuka led the African Zionist movement, BZM went and seized Enugu, uh, Enugu uh, station, broadcasting service in Enugu. The Sahara reporters asked Mazin Namdekanu, what do you have to say about Barista Onwuka led group that sees Enugu broadcasting service? Mazin Namdekanu said, if you know anything you can do to bring down the zoo and you have what it takes, go and do it. He is not against you. But what you cannot do is to use the name of IPUB to do anything. That is why when your people are saying, Mazi Namdi can say, if you know what you will do to restore their friend, do it. Mazi did not say, use IPOB name to be doing something and, I, and the, the world will hold me responsible. No, use your own name to do it. So Mazi will support Simon Epa if Simon Epa is under IPOB. But Mazi will not fight Simon Epa if he go and create a, a, a Simon Epa he do movement. Mazi will disassociate himself from, from him so that tomorrow, if he went into criminality, you will not hold IP, you will be responsible. That is the answer. If you have another question, bring okay. it on. Okay, okay. I get your point, but there's something I want you to understand. Now, you see Mazi Simon Epa. He cannot restore the Afra alone. I want to say, which I think he say that if he has a strategy, he will present our leader. The leadership will look after it, and then if it's uh, something that is achievable, then they will do it. And if it's not uh, according to their plan, they will not uh, do uh, work according to the strategy. Now, that is what you have to say about just that is what you think. It's not what you think, what you believe that will happen. Okay, I want to ask. A situation whereby Marisa Moneba is ready to work with anybody, be it our leader or be it the leadership or the DOS and, all the, uh, and everybody, so long as it is to restore their friend. A situation whereby the man is ready like that way, but the DOS or the, any other person that he is willing to work with is not willing to work with him. Maybe because of the strategy he wants to apply, which is uh, internationally recognized, uh, the DOS, maybe DOS or whosoever, they are not, uh, they, they don't want the strategies to be used. Now, in that situation, someone never know that this this strategy will restore the Afra, but maybe DOS people, they don't want to work with that strategy. Now, him knowing that it will restore the Afra and knowing that DOS will not work in that way. And then he now decided, because he is a disciple of our leader, and our leader recognized him to be a friend. So now, he now knows that working with DOS may bring him back or bring him down or may make him not to apply the wisdom and the strategy he wants to apply to restore the Afra. Then because of that, he can choose to maybe do it on his own and in a way that he knows that our leader will not be offended or will not feel that he has uh, left him. Then he now started doing his own. Now, in that situation, the DOS, do, I want to ask, did the DOS have the right or the anything to like come against him, like attacking him, like calling him names or like making people to feel that he is a taboo or he is not what uh, he claimed to be in the Biafra restoration? Does he give DOS the right to do such things? Knowing fully well that our leader is not with us and knowing fully well that it is only our leader that can stand and tell the Biafran that 
Simon Ekman, what he is doing is wrong for the restoration of Biafra. U.S. know that one. But our leader is not there. Yes, Can you ask your question, make your question straightforward so that I will answer you because you, it's like you ask questions and you answer yourself. You, come, you keep on repeating one thing. No, 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 so no, just I give I simple question and I will, I will answer you. After knowing the strategy and then the U.S. kicked against the strategy of Simon Epa. Now, I want to ask you. Is it right for the US to do such thing? Knowing that the only problem is that Simon Ekba is after arm struggle, which is his own call. And there's nothing anybody can do about it. And our leader cannot even stop that because our leader is not against arm struggle. If it's warrant for us getting the Afra through arm struggle, we'll do it. Uh, uh, my strong. brother, we caught you here because your question is simple. Because I say, go straight to your question. You are making a lot of uh, this thing. According to your statement, you are, which you outlined the strategy of Simon Epa, which is the arm struggle. Now, you said, and I quote, that if Simon Epa has a strategy of restoring Biafra, and he, he know if he present it or he present it to the leadership, and the leadership will reject it. Did the, the, the leadership have right to attack him? Is that your question? Yes. Thank you. Now, I will start with the arm struggle. If Simon Eber has a strategy and he, he, uh, he is into arm struggle, what he will do is to form his own arm struggle, not hijacking the leadership security force to turn to arm struggle. That is the first thing he will create. He will create his own arm struggle, and they call it Simon Eber's arm struggle. For example, Biafran National Guard has Biafran Army working under Biafran National Guard. They don't believe in the DOSN uh, 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 strategy. They believe in arm struggle. And the innocent Oji, being the leadership or uh, being the leader of a B, uh, B, uh, BNG, he formed his own gang and he named it DNG Army. And he fund it, and he do everything. He recruits people he work with, because he know the leadership of IPOB will not accept his uh, strategy. He starts doing his own. If Simon know that the leadership will not accept his own strategy, Mazin Namdekan is not dead. Mazin Namdekan is alive, and Mazin Namdekan is not incommunicado. Mazin Namdekan is reachable. He will pass the information to Mazin Namdekanu. And Mazin Namdekanu is okay. Okay, a barrister, tell him to go ahead. But Mazin Namdekanu have already tell you that any person operating outside IPOB is an infiltrator. You cannot use IPOB to do anything. And the Mazin Namdekanu wife have also come out to say that Mazin Namdekanu don't recognize anything autopilot. And he used the word, uh, she used the word ectoparasite to classify those. Now, the strategy you have, if you have strategy and you have something, you will have what it takes to do that. You don't go into other people's affairs and start hijacking it. That is called criminal offense. So in all the things that is happening, Simon, since I know him, he have not created one group that has arm. The ESN he is talking about was created by Mazin Namdekanu and the DOS. The purpose of ESN, we are made known to Biafrans, which is not to go into arm struggle. So when you have a strategy, you go straight to your strategy. Now, coming to the right, if Simon did not interfere in IPOB affair, by hijacking the finance and they try to hijack the security outfit, the leadership will not call him any name or will not come after him. But for hijacking IPOB finance website created by Martin Namdekanu and hijacking the IPOB uh, account that has more than $1 billion on it, and you tell me that Martin Namdekanu will, will be happy. And the, any person, Mazin Namdekano sack, he will go and pick the person. For example, Felix Onise was expelled by Mazin Namdekano himself on Radio Biafra. 
he went and he spent uh, the money of IPOB with Felix Onyise, forming the Afra government in Eza. Is that armed struggle? So the leadership has no right to attack uh, Gumi of Idu if Gumi did not interfere. What DOS did is to defend the IPOB. So the, 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 the defended IPOB from invaders, from scammers, from, from criminals, led, 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 led by Simon Epa. So Simon Epa did not have a strategy, my brother. If he has a strategy, he could have bring one strategy and use his men to do it. When you say somebody has what it takes to restore the Afra, wait, I am coming. If you say, if you say somebody has what it takes to restore the Afra, I will give you examples of people who think that they have what it takes to restore the Afra. One is Uwazurike. When Uwazurike came up in 1999, he formed Mazop. When he was, uh, maybe he saw that uh, Mazop is no longer the way he wants, they chase him out. He formed BIM, the Afro Independent Movement. Now, Barista Muka don't want to end that fight with uh, Mazop. He did not form Autopilot Mazop, no Autopilot BIM. He formed Biafra Zionist Movement. Because he think he has what it takes to restore Biafra. He form it, he lead. Now, innocent Oji, see that he cannot stay under Wazirike, nor stay under Mazinamnikan, nor stay under the Biafra Zionist movement. He formed Biafra National Guard. Not only that, Prince Wei Richard, see that he want to be, he has what it takes, according to him. He formed Biafra Nation League. Not only that, that he all those one. We have believe human rights. Uche Mefon has an issue, and they think that Mazina Mikani is not doing it right. As a deputy, he moved out. He formed the Afra Human Rights, and he collaborated with uh, uh, Asari Tukumbo. They are formed de facto government. None of them use autopilot IPOB, autopilot Mazop, autopilot anything, but they form their own. So if you think that Simon has what he think what it takes to do anything. Let him form his own. And uh, let us see, not trying to hijack people's effort to make names. Okay. So go, uh, come uh, up with uh, your uh, second. You, uh, you made a very clear point that if Simon ever have, uh, is like maybe he wants to restore the other two arms from that he would have informed the leader chief. The leader will now take it to our leader. Then our leader will give a, a reply on it. That that one, uh, I want to correct that impression. No, that no, that is not that what I said. That, that is what not. Wait, is not, uh, wait, wait, wait. That's what. That is not what because, I answered you. Mm -mm. I say, if Simon you know, know, know that he want to go into armed struggle, he should create his own armed men and arm them to go into armed struggle. Listen, not hijacking listen, another listen, people's. Listen, listen. Listen. You right. Listen. Mm. You say that when. If uh, Simon ever from the initial time that if he wants to do and struggle, that if there is any strategy he has, then he will bring it to the DOS. DOS will now take it to our leader. Then our leader will now reply to know if we are to work on it or if he's not to apply it. That is what you said. Then that is when you were saying that our leader is not in communication, that our leader, people reach out to him mm -hmm. and bring reports from him. So that is what you said. And I want to correct that impression that in freedom fighting, when you, you are a leader is in your enemy's hand, you don't take orders. It's very, very clear. Everywhere, I don't even want us to stress, stress on that issue. But I want you to know that someone, but even me, myself, there are some, I cannot take order from my leader when he is in the hand of enemy. And that's exactly what someone is doing. And it, there is no... There's nothing like sabotaging. There's nothing like doesn't respect. My brother, can, uh, sorry, to sorry, to, sorry, to, sorry to interrupt you. Sorry to sorry to sorry sorry to interrupt you. Sorry to interrupt. Wait. Those people situation is different from my master Moneba own. Why is that master Moneba respect our leader, which is also his leader? So he cannot do anything outside the IPOB because he is still under Namdi Amazi Namdi Kano. So uh, uh, my brother, you are my brother, you can I ask you a question? Oh, everything. Hello? Can I ask you a question? 
Uh, what is it? Now, first of all, you say Simon respect our leader, and the best somebody who respect your leader is calling his wife harlot and organizing people to attack your leader's wife. Is that a respect or insult? I'm not, I'm not sure Simon, Mr. Simon ever can call our leader's wife harlot. Can you? Can you? Can you swear? Personally. Did you hear what I said? I'm not sure. Then someone ever now, if you are not sure, sure, then you answer no, the I'm question. Sure. No, I'm you sure can. The question, sure I, the question I, the question I ask you. Can, okay, can no. you, can you praise those that is calling your leader's wife a lot? Can you praise them and clap for them? If you have respect for your leader. No, it's not good. It's not good. No, can it's you do? Good. Is that respect or insult? Is that I'm respect on is or insult? Is somebody do it? Is an insult. So, which means automatically Simon don't have respect for Mazin Amdekan because he praised Uwa Sophia and Sema and the Nelly when they were calling Mazin Amdekan wife, uh, harlot and criminal, all manner of name. And he continued working with them. Go and check the video I made about Nelly when I caused Nelly. And that was the reason I say Simon continued working with the Nelly. That means he know what Nelly is doing. That's one apart. Can you tell me the reason why Mazin Amdekan form a uh, Form uh, the DOS. DOS, he formed the DOS just for the movement to have structure and in order. So, just uh, so that the Biafrans can take order. Forming DOS is, is, is not that it's, a, it's a again, it's, it's nice, it's good. No, my brother, simple you question. Can you, you know, tell me the reason? Can you tell me the reason why Mazin and the kind of we know? Listen, the people managing the structure, brother, uh, brother, listen, listen, listen. Can you tell me the reason why Mazin and the kind of form DOS? I have told you the reason now. What is the reason? The reason there are there are so many reasons why he formed the DOS. One. One, firstly, firstly is so that Biafra uh, division will have structure. Everything will be in order. So that Biafra can be taking instruction and order from the DOS. Are you getting it? If Mazin Namdekani so is, is, Ma Nam is around or in the absence of Mazin Namdekani? Whether, the thing is this, the thing is this. Whether he is around or he's not around, okay. it is uh, it is assumed that the Afghans take order from the GOS. Okay. Order to do what? There is a there is a bot on it. The bot on it is that only if the people managing the GOS, that is the principal officers, they are genuinely working for the restoration of Biafra, which we are aware. Before we can take instruction from them, in absence of our leader. Okay. Because Uche Mefo was part of the U.S. and to each each Mefo fuck up, and what happened? He was he was expelled. There is every possibility of Chike Dozemo, China Saworo being uh, fucking up in the absence of our leader, and they would be therefore we will not listen uh, to them. Listen, 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 listen. I so, love a simple answer and simple question. Like you just said, yeah. you answered your question that. Is for the leadership to be uh, so that the Biafrans will be taking order. Now, since yeah. the kidnap of Mazen Namdekano, is he working with any group, or they have abandoned him? Everybody is doing his own. If the if he is working with any group, what is the name of the group he is working? And if he is not working with any group, who is leading the movement? Mm -hmm. Mazen Yes. Yes. Up to now. And if yes, mm -hmm. tell me then. I say, is Mazen Namdekano still communicating with any group? If yes, what is the name of the group he is communicating with to how to respond? My, my dear, when it comes to that, to be frank with you. DOS, even China Sawood made a statement before. My brother, I did not ask yeah. you. Up. Listen, when you ask me a question, I go straight to the answer. Please, okay, if okay, I ask, okay. well, you're supposed I to know me by now. You said, you said is our, which group is our leader take, uh, giving instruction from the DSA? That is the question. Right? Yes. Uh, Nepal, don't take your, uh, take your light. 
No, there's no, they can't take like that. Uh, uh, did you I, get my point? I said, if your question is, is, is our leader from DSS uh, still giving instruction to a group? And who, which group is he giving instruction up to now? Is that not your question? Yes. Okay, I want you to know that the 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 uh the people bringing information from DSS to to DOS, you understand? They can bring any information. Put me right. They can bring any information because this information was not given publicly by our direct from by our leader. So they can bring any information. Do you know that there is every possibility? Do you know that there is every possibility of our leader giving information, uh, giving uh, an instruction to Mazinam, to Mazisam, and the, and the the instruction will not be given to him? You know, you know that there is every. Possibility. My brother, can you answer my question and stop uh, and stop jumping around the bush? Can you go straight to the answer and answer me? Simple question: Is Mazinam the can working with any group? If the answer is yes, which group is he working with? Because you cannot tell me that a leader of a group who has a lawyer and he was not in communicado or is not in communicado cannot be working with any person. Who is that group? Because if Mazina can release any message, he must to receive a feedback on the message he, he sent out. So who is he Let working with? You. Simple question. Let me tell you. you. Let me tell you. What, what we all believe is that our, our leader is still working with DOS. That is what we all believe. But I want, you to put, I want to put it to you that our leader where he is now doesn't expect DOS to take any instruction from him from there, if you don't know. Mazi. If you don't know, know it. Our leader Mazi. in that DSS, he doesn't expect Mazi. any other. Mazi. He just expect DOS to do Mazi. what Mazi. he has Mazi. So Mazi. The story in Biafra. Mazi. Mazi, please yeah, always listen to what you are saying, uh, who you are communicating with. If you watch me, I don't answer people. I, 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 do you see, say I insult you or talk anyhow to, with you? No. I want us to have a matured discussion and I want yes. you to be sincere to your own self, not to me. Because the worst thing that can happen to any man is when the man is not sincere to himself. Like you are not sincere to yourself now. Sorry to use this word. Oh. Now, let me come to what you are talking now because I hate people talking rubbish. Sorry to use this word. The question I ask you is this. Who is Mazi working with? Mazi has a blueprint. And I know what is, I know you know what is called a blueprint. Who did Mazi leave that blueprint with? And did that blueprint contain every step you will be taking one after the other? Who did Mazi leave it with? Mazi is Mazi Namdekan is working with IPOB, and he still maintains the DOS structure which he has, he laid down until when he's out. Okay, so that is the question. Can you explain to my viewers this statement coming from Mazi Namdekan today? Let me read it out for you so that you can explain it, what it means, please. I want you to explain this uh, very place. Uh, this place, Let me, uh, are you ready to, to hear it? I can hear I'm Now, listening. that the activities of the di uh, dissident Marudas who engage in criminal activities have further um, embodied the blood testy and the untrained Nigerian security agent to leash to unleash unimaginable terror on innocent people of the southeast region. First, there is a word I want you to explain to their friends. This word is called dissident, it is spelled D I double -S, S I G E T E N T S. Can you please explain that word to their friends? So that they will understand, please. Me, I wouldn't. I I didn't go to school to be explaining words like that. But what I understand the statement. I understand the statement, and uh, what I can say from the statement is this: all the things centered on why uh, Zoom military is uh, invading the uh, the Afrika land to steal and all that. 
Then you people's mindset is because of the courage that is happening. Maybe you think you people think that is my time on Ebana, maybe that is sending maybe unknown government and all that, and it's causing this all this problem. And now, according to uh, you, our leader is emphasizing on that. No, trying uh, to let everybody. You, no, Mazi, you try, but you did not get it. Let me explain it to you. As I am speaking to you now, go to your Google and uh, search. Ask Google, what is the meaning of dissident? Dissident is a person who opposes official policy, especially that of an authoritarian state. Now, in other words, somebody who opposes official policy, that is a laid down rule, who opposes it. Now, why Mazinam can use that word is, Mazi is against anyone who is against his rule and his policy to restore Biafra, which is Simon is the only person that is against that rule of Mazi Namdekanu. Because, wait, I am coming because I am explaining the word dissident to you. Because yeah. dissident yeah. is what you don't understand. And I am explaining it. And that is why I contacted my encyclopedia to explain it to you for a layman understanding so now that Mazi have told you that this guy is working against the rule and against the way i want the effort to be restored what do you have to say okay now listen the way you know our leader is a diplomatic man he, 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 his mindset was to restore Biafra in a diplomatic way but it doesn't mean that if even he made that statement it doesn't mean that if the zoo refused diplomatically that he cannot use another strategy like arm struggle. It does not mean that. Now, <laughs> DOS, according to the, the way he taught DOS and the way you put it, is you are centering your mind on diplomatic way to restore Biafra. And anybody pushing like gun and arm struggle and all that is outside the diplomatic way, which is the structure that is laid, according to you people. Forgetting that our leader come out today and yeah. to warrant uh, uh, IPOB restoring Biafra through armed struggle that our leader yeah. will be ready. Mas, he has, he has before I will leave you because so, I don't have much time. I have already spent a lot of time. Before I leave what, you, what, only one what, more what question. So, to, only one more question so that you can go. No, I want you to go because uh, you have uh, spent a lot of time. Our leader will not as in, if it will warrant all the story in the effort, you have to, our, our leader will be ready for it. Imagine, you cannot keep on... Yeah. Uh, listen, you have uh, already taken much of my time. And like I said, the worst thing that can happen to any man is when the man is not sincere to himself. And uh, I really appreciate you for coming to test your brain. But last question is this. What is the purpose of uh, Mazin Namdekanu establishing the Eastern Security Network? And who are the people he establish it with and give the rules of Eastern Security Network. He established ESN to, to safeguard our land and then protect our uh, mothers and fa uh, fathers and then our sisters and brothers in the farm so that they can farm without the disturbance of the flan men. That is the reason why ESN was formed. Okay. And uh, who are the people that he formed it with? I have fr from the beginning, uh, I think, according to information, China Sawuru is one of the people that have the access to the ESN, one of the commander, overall commander, whatsoever. Is that uh, an answer to I the question I ask you? I say, who are the people he formed it with? He formed ESN with? Or do you Who think he did formed ESM with, or do you think Mazinam can pick one person and form ESM? Oh, I, I don't know all the people he formed the ESM, but uh, thank, you. Thank, are, you. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. We have already spent uh, 30 you minutes, know. I have what already spent 30 that? minutes with you, so thank you for your yeah. wonderful contribution, Maz. I will leave you here, but uh, I want I you to. I want, to, I want to say something. No, wait. I want I, to say something. No, I uh, don't have that much time again. I have a, a brother that I will use to 
end this program because I've already spent. You should have let me. You should have no, let me clear. No, clear nothing. Your viewers no, about no, this no, you know nothing about. Know you, know, you, know, about no, you know nothing about it. I should you not clear. allow it to confuse people. So you know nothing about it. So I, uh, I will. I will. I will let you go. There, there. Please. Uh, next time we will talk. Next time when we talk, uh, uh, Mazi Prince Darlington he has been calling and calling and calling and calling. I know I have offended many of you, but like uh, Jesus said, I come for I did not come for the the healthy one. I come for the sick. This broadcast is not for DOS members; it's for the autopilot. That is why I choose to spend a lot of time with them. Please, so bear with me. Hello, I'm not coming in a i can not um listening to him from the beginning but from the time i started listening to him i saw a man uh struggling to you know to deceive him to to deceive himself I you know wandering from him. left to right to right uh from left to right from right to left you know exactly however let me just introduce myself for those that doesn't know me my name is mazo uh, prince Dalentin, uh mazio so um AKA as the hot for television. Confirm. Cool. Uh, I can get in there because all the people who are not going to be able to get in there. Oh, did you? 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 Incoherent. The guy is incoherent. Exactly. You know, if he would have allowed, uh, maybe uh, uh, if you do another program where you can invite one autopilot, you know, you will stay as a as a moderator. Then you call one person who is um, a, a diehard, bona fide member of uh, Indigenous people of Biafra. You know, autopilot.
in the unit where you belong to. Once you take uh, you take um, an oath from the family you, you belong to, that is the, the kindergarten level of becoming an IPOB member. Because maybe this person doesn't have an idea about what I'm saying, but I know he's listening. And I just want to use this opportunity to educate him a little bit. You understand? Exactly. So if you took that oath, because if you get that is the way we do, we do it. You have to remove your shoe, or you, even if your shoe, if you buy it to $100,000, you understand? Exactly. Before you take the oath. So, and why taking that oath? There is a particular place in that oath that says something that captured my mind. And I want to remind that person so that he will listen and get uh, acquainted to what I am talking about. That particular place says, if I ever, if I ever go against, if I ever go against or do anything that is contrary to what is going to, what, uh, that, uh, to what we are, is going to give us our, our, our struggle, let this happen to me. Then if I do anything that will jeopardize the life of my fellow principal officers, let you look at them and wipe away my family and myself. You see, that particular place is where we steal all the infiltrators and all the enemies. That if they listen to it or they had an idea about that oath, so many of them do run away. They will say, no, I am not going to take that oath. I have many, many, do you know that George only they refuse to take oath? George Onibe refused to take oath. It took George Onibe a long time before he, you know, accepted to take oath. What mm -hmm. I'm telling you is what I know. Then when we when we when we when we extended that our oath by going to an an announce of our supreme, a lot of people say they are not going there. That what we are going to do there is this and that because they know that they cannot keep that law that makes you to be a bona fide member. They cannot. That is the reason why so many of them say, I'm not going there, I'm not going there. But those that accepted to go there are people that are pure at heart. People that believe, you, they believe that they cannot betray their brother, they cannot say the struggle, they cannot go against the rules and regulations that is abiding, that is guiding the, 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 the movement. Now, you as a Chebe, you did this, I did it, so many of us did it. The person he is talking about now, Ekmerima himself, did he do it? No. Did he go through that channel? He did not go through that channel. The reason why he did not go through that channel is because he was seeing a constituted coordinator, a coordinator that is working under the under the organogram of IPOB that Martin Nandekano signed and approved that this person have gone, he has done all the necessary things that supposed to do. He, is qualified as a member and for that reason he is now coordinating other people so before you become a member in that unit you have to come that coordinator will give you oaths in that particular zone or unit Ebenema said he will not take that oath because the coordinator that's supposed to you know administer that oath to him is a moron i don't know that you're getting my point life and he direct said that the guy is a moron I just, I just, I'm not telling you. I'm not telling you what I heard. It is what Ibrahim himself told me. I don't lie against people because I'm under oath. I tell you the way it is. You understand? So Ibrahim said that the guy is a moron. That over mm. his dead body with a moron gives him oath. On that, you know, Ibrahim started from beginning when he wanted to come inside. He started from beginning. Showing his, his attitude, showing his character, showing his uh, his uh, stubbornness, showing every of he was giving us the break line, showing us pointer that I am coming for destruction. That is why he looked down on a, a whole coordinator of Finland, national coordinator. This is not a unit coordinator even. He said that the guy is a moron that he cannot administer oath to him. Hmm. I counted it as one. When I when I talked to him, I said, brother, what? Why don't you allow this guy to give you oath? Or say more, the truth is that the guy has nothing upstairs. Then somebody has that somebody has that no, the guy has nothing upstairs. Does that very much have something upstairs? <laughs> and he could not coordinate uh, uh, Adam. We are working now. So okay, yeah. Can worry about can worry Adam. 
He would have been able to coordinate his wife and his only one son. If you cannot coordinate your wife and only one child that you get birth to, how can you coordinate people? And the coordinator, who is a national coordinator that is coordinating all Finland, you say he's a moron, that is, he doesn't have any knowledge to, to administer to you. I believe you that, I, I, I believe you that this guy that called now, why this thing to me? He will understand that from the approach, the road which you are supposed to pass to come into this noble family, Ibrahima did not pass that road. He wanted to come through the window. Also, go through the window, Emma But the truth is that as long as you did not lay your foundation on where any house you build on that ground will sink. If you could be a bullion. Exactly. That is why you just here. This are the things that this person that called you now doesn't know about ever. And the reason why I go back to the grassroots is by the time I begin to, you know, to point some things that he doesn't know that ever have that ever have done, he will begin to say, Oh, is this the reason why you guys are after this guy? Try chasing him away. No. What is after him anyway, but to just him away, letting him know that he refused to come through the right channel, he refused to come through the right door. He came, he wanted to jump into the window, and we told him, No, it is not possible. Now, I will say this the road he passed to enter into IPOB, threat to enter IPOB was not genuine because he wanted to, you know, he, he saw the coordinator as a moron, he saw the coordinator as a, as a, as a, as a mad person, and that coordinator, mad man, can. She used to see him as intelligent and the, someone who is able and capable to handle other coordinators. Because when you come to a country, the national coordinator is a coordinator of all coordinators in that country. Am I speaking well? Am I life, speaking and well? life and direct. That is exactly. Every, every yes, coordinator sir. is answerable to national. And national is answerable yes. to Thank European you. rep. And the European Thank rep you. is answerable no, to... No. The, the director of state. Yeah. Beautiful. That is to say, if we have, for example, if we have 30 units in, if we have 30 units in Finland, we have 30 able men that are, you know, answerable to this coordinator that is national coordinator, that Ekberima is calling a moron. In other words, Ekberima have just seen the truth about our organic group and the undermined the, the the rules and regulations of IPOB and insults all, insulted all the IPOB members in China, including Martin Mandicano, who put the rules and regulations. That is something that some people do not know. You see, after having done that, another that you need to look into deeply is this. When Ekberima wanted to, uh, when uh, he wanted to interview our leader Martin Mandicano, our leader said, no, you are going to take us before you interview me. And that interview was in a haste. It was something that has to do between today and tomorrow. Now, why didn't Martin Nankano tell to, uh, to the Dele uh, Momodi to go and, to, uh, and, and, uh, and took us before you will interview him? I'm asking you this question. Because this person that called you now, I believe you will be listening and you will have every reason to understand the reason why Ekberima is Ekberima and the reason why he is not a member of IPOB. The reason why anywhere we see Ekberima, we treat him like Ekberima because he's an Ekberima. Exactly. And he's a Finnish citizen. It is Finnish. Must go ahead, you are making a lot of points. What Ekberima wanted to interview our leader, our leader said, no, you can't interview me. You have to go and take oath. And because there is no, the interview is in a, you know, it's like something that has to do in a haste. It was not well planned. You understand? Then what happened? But he said, okay, uh, let, me, uh, let me call somebody uh, to uh, administer oath to me. And the, the person that brought the idea of him, of him taking oath, was uh, uh, was uh, our leader. Then the person that was available at that time was the secretary of our leader. Then the secretary of our leader is not a coordinator, so she cannot administer oath to Ekberima. Then she now called the mother because the mother was holding a post in IPOB then. So it was the mother, Adama Brown, 
that administered uh, oath to Ibrahima. Do you know that Ibrahima was lying to the world, telling that it was more than the canoe of all people that gave him oath? This was the, the <laughs> first biggest lie I, I heard from him. Like, you imagine that I can administer oath to me? No! Master gave instruction. And, and as Adam Abraham is still alive, it was Adam Abraham who gave him oath. Now, if you watch how I'm giving you all these instances and what has happened in the past, you will understand that the guy is a braggado. Do you know that this guy told me that there is a law that will see somebody and, we, and, and the law will change? That a law can be pending and can be changed when you see a certain kind of person. So when somebody that is new to a, to, to a struggle or to an organization, he already sees himself being above that organization. Because for him to see that coordinator as not qualified to administer to him, that is to say that he is more superior than the organization that the guy is managing. So for that reason, he said that there is a law that will see somebody and that law will be bended. I said, eh? Chineke, how can you do that? That is another <laughs> thing. Brother, you that is watching, that is listening, I want you to be taking note of this laid down um, findings about the Ebrema before now. Exactly. Apart from that, I want to make it fast because I believe you, have, you must have spent a long time here. Let me just... More than three chat. hours. Now, when, our, when this guy is saying that we are not supposed to take order from our leader because he's in the hand of the enemy, I want to touch that area. But if our leader was in the hand of the enemy and gave instruction that Ekberima should come and broadcast on, on, on Radio Biafra, why did Ekberima accept that part that our leader said from the dungeon of BSS. Are you with me? Are you the reason me? Yes. These are the questions so to pilot me to answer. Broadcast on Radio Biafra. You took it. He did not give that instruction. Uh, um, uh, he did not uh, give that instruction when he was outside with us. He gave it while he is he's still inside DSS. Are you getting it? Life and the right. So looking at look looking at the situation. And looking at the situa situation at hand, that is to say that that instruction that our leader gave, everybody was, was not supposed to talk about it or accept it because Matthew was inside the DSS dungeon. He was supposed to say, no, I will not come to uh, the real effort to broadcast because the instruction is coming from someone who is in the, in the hand of the enemy. Am I making sense? So he wrote that one so dear and announced himself because one of him, the guy was also, you better go. So on our board, our board, so now we jump. So yeah, the man is far, you know. When we finish, you know, the city have So he was too faster than his shadow. He wanted to be faster than his shadow. That is why he announced himself without remembering that the people who are supposed to give, who give you that platform to speak are supposed to vent you. That's what is called venting. They are supposed to tell you this is where to go. This is where not to go. This is what, and this is what we don't accept in IPOB as long as you want to broadcast. He did not want to listen to all those things because he was seeing himself being an above, over and above the people in Radio Biafra, just as he saw himself as someone who is above the coordinator in Finland. I, I, don't know, uh, uh, I believe that this guy that called you, that is in your body listening and taking the, the cognizance of everything I'm saying here now. I believe he is jotting it down.
Jesus that is upon us, put our, upon our program now. Us in the program is dead body, that he is going to broadcast there unconditionally. That nobody should give him condition. That our leader, that people should, should obey, that people should obey our leader's instruction. <laughs> this instruction is coming from someone who was <laughs> in DSSO. Who yes, is in the party. And he said that he said that we must obey it. DOS, uh, the DOS must obey it. Uh, Magician, that's a war uh, uh, for man, all the whole media track, um, uh, department must obey the last command of Martin Mankan because it's an order. That is what you know, uh, I say. Then I called him and said, Bro, listen, there is how we do things here. You know, because he did not come from the kindergarten level to understand how our IPOB operates. He doesn't know how we work. That is why he didn't know that before you take charge or be a part of media, there are things that you will you will be lectured. And I could see the case of Let us have our Facebook live that will just click and begin to talk. No. And I could see the case of Israel. And I could see the case of Israel. He's supposed to go lecture at least for two weeks. Two solid weeks lecture. A professional who are behind it will tell him, this is what to do, this is what to do. This, there are software that, that, they, they, will, that they will give to him that he, he will use to be broadcasting whenever it is his own turn. Because it was a slot that was given to him. He didn't know all these things because also in a window, we are not at that. No. Ah. When Edwin finally you know, decided that nothing will make him to obey the instruction and follow the organogram, how the latest rules and regulations on how to broadcast on Radio Biafra. I called him and said, bro, you are making another mistake. The first mistake you made was to disobey order to go and take oath from your, your coordinator, where you came from. The second one is now that you are coming to say uh, you are asked to go and take a slot and broadcast on Radio Biafra, and now you are telling the world that you cannot take oath, uh, you cannot uh, uh, follow the, the rules and regulations, that you must broadcast unconditional because Martin Namdekano's order must be obeyed. That is an order for Martin Namdekano. Now, I remind him that, bro, if you buy a new phone, before you use it, there is what is called agreement. If you didn't, if you didn't uh, click, if you read the agreement, you click accept, that you cannot get into that phone. Exactly. Set with laptop. Even WhatsApp. Gadgets, even Nigeria government. That oath of office that the president is taking all over the world. That is what you are supposed to do before you are welcome. You say you will not do it. What is brother that called now to be taking note of all this? Thing? So, to cut it more shorter, the truth is this. When I, I approached him, I told him, I said, bro, you see now, people are saying that you are, you know, the Nigerian government are saying that you are taking over the Dodi Afra, this and that. You are going to go out, out there to tell them that you are not taking over the Dodi Afra. That what you are doing is to take a slot and broadcast on Radio Biafra. That Martin Nandekano is the leader of indigenous people of Biafra, and Radio Biafra is under IPOV, which the Director of State is in charge. That you are not coming to take any, even a chunk of it as a, as a, as a leader. I discussed with him like three hours after he said, okay, he went out. He listened to that, my advice. He went out and made a, made a publication that said, that Martin Namdekano, that IPOB leadership remain intact, that Martin Namdekano is the leader of IPOB, that he is not, the, uh, he is not in charge of Zero Biafra, and that stopped there. My brother, do you know when I knew that these people that are following this guy are all idiots, they are all animals, is when they, they, when they begin to say that we, we do not listen to Martin Namdekano's instruction that uh, uh, should be broadcast on Zero Biafra, now they forget that he, he, he refused to take order. He, sorry, he refused to take uh, to follow the normal process so before he would be able to broadcast. Then they now come again and say that because of what uh, they are doing to to to, to Ibelima, and for that reason that they will not have right to challenge them. And when they begin to say that people should not listen to Radio Biafra, people should not uh, uh, contribute money, people should stop going to meetings. Are you aware when I said all this? Yes, I'm aware. Because the other the other that that uh, Barrister Jofo is bringing from Martin and the canon is corrupted. That is not that he is no longer going to listen to order of anybody who is in the DSS dungeon. But you listen to the order of person that is in the DSS dungeon for you to come and broker. But you will not listen to the order of the person when it is time for you to do the needful. And these people are still saying that uh, Samuel Eba is not doing anything bad. Tell us the party is doing. Number one. 
Some will never insult Mazen Namdekanu, by disobeying his order. Order of Mazen Namdekanu is that before you broadcast on Radio Diaspora, you have to pass through the right channel. You have to sign that particular agreement and, and do what you are supposed to do. The other is that before you join IPOD, be a, be a member, a qualified member, you must go through the third process from the, from the credo. That, those are the order. So for you to disobey the first order, disobey the second one, disobey the third one, and finally say you will not take order from Mars, see, that is the biggest slap. When they talking about Mars, this wife is um, insult. That one is a very clean, clear picture of everything that people who believe in Egberima should look deeply and see that they are all fools. Because this is the wife of our leader. She did not even mention the name of Egberima that very day. She, she, she only used the word exoparasite. And she gave the interpretation of what exoparasite says and what it means and the work. Then Egberima and his cohort became angry. They pick it up, became angry. Do you know why? Because Ekmenima is not seeing IPOB leadership as anything. That is why he will always tell you that I only respect Martin Namdekano. <laughs> he said it is only Martin Namdekano that he respects. That no other person. Does it ask people voting to you? If you are respecting only Martin Namdekano without Martin Chikedo system and the members of the Rectorate of State, we just Martin Namdekano. Without Major Former in the media department, we just Martin Namdekano. Without the finance department that are people that are printing money for the movement to the movie does it really make a forest? Well, it is all this thing put together that is the matter that we're talking about. When you bring the department, the, the media, bring the, 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 the director of state, bring the finance department, bring the ESN command, put them together. That is matter than the camera. So now, do you know when this guy shot himself on the leg and his followers still follow him? And because, because I, think, I think the guy was sharing money, because money was shared, I knew about this, is when he now went to create what he called, uh, what he called, um, uh, M branch. M fake M branch. He, he, he called it uh, uh, Eastern Security Network M branch. This guy even fronted the guys he called M branch on video, showing the whole world. And what is our brother called to be listening? He showed the picture and the videos of the people he called emperor to the whole world. Do you know about uh, about about uh, about um, about uh, uh, the CIA? Do you know that some people that are members of CIA in America, their wife doesn't know? Exactly. Do you know that MI5 in, in the United Kingdom, some some of the members of family doesn't know that their, their husband or their brother or their sister are members of MI5? The same thing with uh, the Russian intelligence. Is it KDG, uh, uh, KG or whatever, whatever they call it? Now, Martin Nandekano have put this uh, M branch in this struggle for a very long time. M branch is over eight years old. Actually, I'm saying it on a platform mm. so that this guy that called should get sense. I don't want to insult him because he was sounding like someone that is, is ready to repent and ready to learn. If not, I will be out. You know me now. I'll be looking <laughs> insult on him mm. because Nandi Rinde, I better call my mother. Nobody knew about M branch. You cannot come out now and point to one person and say this is a member of M branch in this in this struggle. Nobody knew them. Only Martin Nam the Canada knew them. But when I came and showed the whole world, this is the M branch, and they were saluting him on video. And he, he doesn't even know the meaning of M branch. There was a video I did on him. And he watched that video and he got sick for three days. So they don't know after watching that video. Because I was I watched him claim. I told him, I took him in the line of lecture. To let him understand that you talk from the window, so you must be everything you are doing, there must be a mistake. So, this person that is calling now should understand that for him to come and form another M branch, for him to refuse to take uh, to take oath from the uh, family unit where he belongs, for him to refuse to, you know, sign the normal paper he was supposed to sign before he broadcast, all these things are put together, shows that he is not a member of IPOD. Simple. And that is why he went and said, now he has his own ESN. If they did not form any ESN, before Martin Nandekano formed ESN, Martin Nandekano taught the whole world. Martin Nandekano touched the whole world. But when people were just met to this, Martin Nandekano met in Europe. There was a time Martin Nandekano traveled to, 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 to Japan. And the, in the building where Martin Nandekano was broadcasting from was shaking. Martin Nandekano was shaking. Martin Nandekano was shaking. Martin Nandekano was shaking. Everybody has not 
<laughs> uh, so even in the field that you're in, you don't have a common one, one coordinator as autopilot coordinator in Finland. No, not one. You don't. He has not traveled from Finland to America to go and to, to go and coordinate or to even preach or to do any 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 town hall meeting. Nothing. Just from nowhere. Bring him. You come. You want to be. You, you want to be a leader. From nowhere. You want to, you, 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 are the, you are the commander of ESN. From nowhere, you are the commander of a uh, 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 security network. From nowhere, you, you, are, you are this, you are that. You, you become the, 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 the dragon that Martin Dan can raise. So you are the dragon now. From there, he becomes ESN. From, oh boy. This, anybody where they ask questions, say, why are you people attacking Epa? Well, that person needs to care. Only to be why is she, she is a good Why is she? A group of million and you see, when just try you see, my family also. Because Maria is a baby. Oh, that's why we have people who are this. Because Maria is a man. Oh, you are a man. Oh, you are a man. So, why I'm saying this, putting it in line is because I have a lot, but let me just cut it from here. Let this guy that called you, that we're asking all these irrelevant questions, talking like a, like a, on your, on your, on your, on your, on your, know that every step that a man took in this struggle, is against a believer because he, he didn't follow the, the, the proper channel. And that is why I will keep telling the whole world that a Tamil experiment is a thief and he's not a member of IPOB. Do you remember when people were, oh, you got to bam, bam, bam. people were saying, don't delete the code, delete the code. I came out. I spoke about the kind of oath he took. I said the truth that the oath he took was Adam Mabra that gave him oath. But the normal oath we used to take is you must go to the family member where you belong and take oath from there. But people will be saying, no, 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 no. He's doing a great job. Which great job are you doing? He's nailing that win. That was a model for almost 10 years, 11 years. So that's why I die. I have no use. Who does that? Can only name to ask. You came into the structure. You have to look at the structure has been structured. The movement has been structured. Without uh, the, the, the leadership of this movement, brother, forget. We will not go anywhere. Exactly. If it's only person and the can that is managing the finance, managing the the, the day, day in and day out affair, being coordinator in America, being coordinator in Asia, you go that. You see that back here. Yeah, can you call like a catch all of the case here? Yeah, or yeah, that you see, yeah, you see Jim Bona how an artist came in. I don't want to see Jim now for the problem number from the top of my someone left Paketa. Oh, you are commander of ESN, no shit here. You are commander of uh of uh Kenya Nabe uh of Ndo 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 Abu M branch in here. You are Abu Dragon. You are Abu Yemi. No, you are Abu Kwa. The Prime Minister of of the Afrika government in Nigeria. I ask them one question. Eba, as a person, did he still acknowledge Martin Nandikano as his leader? Inside his heart, no. But nobody born here, he is perceiving them that Martin Nandikano is our leader. Is our leader. If Martin Nandikano give order, let's sit at home, stop. If you acknowledge him as your leader, you will not come out and still be shouting, sit at home, sit at home. Even if people want to sit at home on their own. Yeah, I see many times that our, our, our media, uh, our media, um, uh, you know, gave a... Uh, um, uh, put up a, 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 a what do you call it? Um, put up um, a publication acknowledging those people who were sitting at home willingly. Voluntarily, yes. He was acknowledging them, telling them people share them go zero for sitting at home willingly, not to enforce it. But the eight man was enforcing it because such only force a will to become a leader. Such only force a will to be whatever he is, he, he is not. Look at everywhere you go to do a layer. Problem there. The, the people that you want to you say you want to have alliance with and they claim to be uh, the BFR spokesperson, look at the problem in their camp now. They are resigning. Everybody, okay, let's go and also look at innocent dodgy that he went to have video chat with. All the, look at what is happening to the man now. My brother, this guy is very man. It's like Buhari. Everyone of Buhari is a bad law. You don't know that's a bad law. I can only use Buhari to qualify someone with very man. So anybody that is a member of Autopilot that listen to this should know that we have 101 reason to deal with this guy mercilessly, both on social media and physically. Up to you know, all the social media social media as well. And they follow you day, day in and day as movement in, in Finland, in case you don't know. Come up here, I'm following you. All the social media. Because you are the woman. 
Then when a man who told you to America, told you to London, told you to different country, but I'm Finland because of the Kerima. What on America can in Kiyazu? Let him know because people have died because of him. He has killed so many people in this struggle, and he is making money out of the blood of innocent people, and he think he will go scot free. Of all the men meeting, he is doing meeting for me. I was the only time meeting. All more the woman that the school became. All the time meeting, young man, I'm married because I'm one married or more. So thank you very much, my brother. So that Having listened to this, he will, and based on the question you ask him and how you have tutored him out so far, he, he will know that a very man is, is a is a hot work. Exactly. I believe him na ojo to a lot of things down. And don't matter what to do here. Of course. Dalu rinne. Of course. Dalu. Of course. Of course. Thank you very much. Dalu rinne. They are friends and lovers of freedom. I will be drawing the curtain down here. Three hours, 30 minutes. Echibolu, Nkayagapoluna, Elemon, Echinine. And uh, I thank every one of you who made out your time to be here with me. I say, Mechuko Kabi, I'm a guide and protect you all. Please, I will no longer pick call. I will no longer pick call. I have already closed the day. We have spent a lot of time, so please bear with me. If you want to join me, join me tomorrow. This caller, I will not. Uh, okay, let me just say uh, two minutes, two minutes, two minutes, two minutes. Tell us your name and where you are calling from. Your time start now. Two minutes. Stop listening to yourself. If you continue listening to yourself, I will cut you off. Hello? Hello? You are not serious. Uh, Biafrans and lovers of freedom. I'll call it a day. Thank you, Biafrans and lovers of freedom. And I say, remain blessed. No retreat, no surrender. No need of uh, talking too much. We have come to the end of the pro today's program. Until I come your way again, almost here, Biafra. IPOB. One family, one family, IPOB. Those that I did not pick their call, please forgive me. I am sorry. Tomorrow is another day. Prepare. I will, I will come earlier. Thank you and remember this.